Good evening, gamers. Hope you're doing well. Good to have you all back for another day of Dragon's Dogma 2. I have been really enjoying this game. It's been a really good time. It's been a good time, man. Despite, uh, you know, a lot of the negative press that it's getting, it is still pretty dang good. I'm still enjoying it quite a bit. Here we are back in the city. What is my next objective? I know we picked up a whole bunch of quests at the end of stream last night. So let's take a look. Uh, slip into the palace of the dead of night. Oh, right. There's that. Magistrate is only prepared to leave itself. You can find a place of refuge. Oh, right. That's a thing too. Pay a visit to Fulvio, a sculptor residing in Batal. Make contact with a mysterious figure. Yeah, I have a stalker apparently. Um, argument between a merchant and his customer and the scaly invaders. Let's start off with the scaly invaders. I want to see if there's anything else going on down there. It's a bit of a, a bit of a walk, but I think it's worth our time. I think it's worth our time. There's a ladder here. There's a ladder here. Let me start off with making it daytime by taking a quick little nap. A quick little nappy poo. Can't get like something. <laughs> you can't like something that gets negative press trimmer. Oh my god. Way to really forge a new path in life. Liking things that everyone else is being negative about. Now, to be fair. To be fair. Um, a lot of the things that people are upset about are fair. And rightfully so. I get it. But, I, I you know, I'm ignoring that and I'm still having a good time, so. Upon his return from beyond the rift, defeat Cyclops. Cyclops Clobberer. Oh, apparently he's he's helped five people kill Cyclops now. That's my boy. Look at that. I was given a hunter's bow. Nice. New pawn quest. Um, sure. Pawn badge. Let's get Griffin Grounder. Griffin Grounder. Um, and we'll pay we'll pay a thousand gold on this one. We'll give him a nice one one thousand gold. All right. How's that sound, guys? That sound nicer than the five gold on the previous Cyclops adventure? Oh my god, getting this to actually land on the spot I wanted to is kind of annoying. Look at that, dude. If you scroll, you could, you could scroll right by it way too easily. That's insane. There we go. Confirm. Majin Kai, thanks for watching on both sides. What up, Gizmo? Hey, Myth of Blue, Cactuar, Screamer, Cole, Excuse for Gaming, Laura, Pantafels, Brandon. David, Emmer, Calrid, Ludozeal, Super Sugar Spice. What's going on, guys? How are we doing today? I feel refreshed and ready for a new day. Refreshed and ready. Go, Shall we get underway? Yep. Let's go. What up, AV? Hey, Jojo. I'm liking the game quite a bit, man. It's a good time. Hey, Burex. What is this gold icon? What is that doing there? Oh, oh, whoa, oh, oh. whoa. Goblins have attacked the city, apparently. Why are goblins suddenly here? If we mastered that attack, we would be invincible. Whatever it is you need. Why are goblins randomly in the city? What the hell? Aren't there supposed to be guards on this bridge? You would think that the bridge itself, the entrance to the city, would be guarded. Unless the goblins overtook them. What up, snowboards? If you've anything edible, what happens if Josh's YouTube and Twitch streams cross streams? Um, a giant cataclysm opens up underneath everyone's feet and we all end up in one universe. It's crazy, dude. Are here about. It's actually insane. I'd say we collect as much as we can carry. No sense letting the enemy gain the upper hand. <laughs> Oh. 
No, there's more gobos out here. More gobby Lord boys out here too. To the thrill of victory. One cannot help but feel indomitable. No doubt this triumph will spur. How do I tell if I'm a member? If your name is green, then you are a member. If it's not, then you are not. Ooh, Cyclops. Well, hello there, sir. How you doing, bud? Look out, Terrizen! You're under attack! Come, let me grant you wings. Let my magic okay, break that off. Very good. Climb onto his face, please. I can't see because of the tree. Oh, not what I wanted to do. I just fell off. I wait for stamina. And up we climb. What's going on? All right, we're on top of him. Recover a little stamina, please. Oh, he's flailing about, dude. Oh, I'm going flying. God, dude, I'm having a hard time actually getting up to his face. Climb up to him. Onto his face. No! Why does he let go? Oh, I had no stamina again. Damn. What is going on with my stamina? Oh, it's because I'm very heavy, dude. I'm very heavy. That makes a lot more sense. Give all this excess stuff over to uh, Billy, please. At least for now. I'm sitting here wondering what the hell's going on. Here, Rob, have a bow. Why not? Why not? I need to get myself down to average weights. Here, Kira, have some rotten fish <laughs> and some rotten beast steak. How about a princess harsh bird? Yeah, dude, it's great. It's good. You can have the spell tomes as well. Uh, da da da. There you go, buddy. Have some of these. We're almost there. Minotaur horns. I'm sure those are a bit heavy. Yep, they sure are. There we go. Now we're down to average. My stamina will be better off now. So you're wondering why I'm running out of stamina when I've done this so many times. What's up, Ben? Now we do it. Yeah. I just took his eye right out of his face. You see that? Oh, that attack is actually insane. That's what I wanted to do that whole time. What is being heavily difficult about it? There we go. Level 19. Very good. I'll pick that up. We might have need of it. My I'm back into heavy territory again because I picked up these ogre parts. Let's pass them over there. I forgot I, I got a griffin pinion. Okay, and we're back on the path. Dude, it's, you know, it's kind of cool how the weight affects stamina, but when you when you require a certain amount of stamina to make certain plays, like getting up to his face and then using gut and run, it just, it's so harsh. 
I would have preferred not to have to fight so soon. It's so harsh. I'm sure you know I'm not usually a salty gamer. However, if this heckin' alien grabs me from the vent one more time, I'm a rage. <laughs> yeah, they're uh, they're pretty good at that, aren't they? It can be annoying, for sure. We have wolves. Also a harpy. Get down here. Oh my god. With your time in the game, how is the depth complexity of the character progression? Um, so the, the, the complexity comes with being able to choose the class that you want to whenever you want to. Like that's where the real complexity of this game comes into play. Everything else is pretty straightforward. You do have to make a few choices with what skills you want to take with you, depending on like how you want to build your, you know, your, uh, your attacks and such. It's just like, it ultimately depends on that, but the real complexity does indeed come with just making choices on what, what class you want to play and how it's, uh, how it vibes with the rest of your squad that this you have with you. You can go all in on one thing. You can like divide it up between a couple of classes, a, a couple of specific types of damage. It's just, there's complexity there, but it's all based on the decisions you make with your own character and the pawns you add to your team. Uh, is there more? Oh, well. You can see that right now my damage is very overbearing for these enemies. I just take them out so quickly. I've done a lot of quests, Ludo Zeal, where I've not really been actively gaining experience. But now that I have them out of the way, everything else is going to be faster. Let us return once we've grown tired from our labors. Climb up his front and tweak his nipples. <laughs> yeah, that'll surely upset the Cyclops. That'll get him. Oh, that guy's got like a flamberge type thing going on there. And uh, before I forget, um, adventuring is toilsome as tis, and yet you do it with a lady. Did I just hear a griffin? I cannot but admire your strength. I think I just heard a griffin. It certainly isn't easy work, but I'm proud to be counted upon. Did I not? Oh, is it down below here then? Maybe... I thought I heard a roar and then a flap of wings, but maybe I'm just hearing something else entirely. Oh! It's an ogre. And that's why I heard it from above. He was hanging from the mountainside. Oh my god, chop him in the dick, dude.
Poing, 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 poing. I thought that was a griffin because the sound was coming from above. Now very confused there. Very confused. Now we gotta head south. It's going well, Puck. How are you, man? How do I like the game so far? I'm enjoying it a lot, Wojtek. Where the Saurians? Ice will be most effective against this foe. All right, you guys are fighting the Saurians back here. I thought they were in front of us for some reason. Hey, got to be honest. Why are you guys going back here? Come to me. You shouldn't be going backwards. I shan't allow any further harm to come to you. The combat is satisfying, I agree. Uh, that is a dragon. I'm fighting this. It says Drake, and then he's calling my name. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. This is new. Go on, climb him. I'm just gonna stab him right here. I don't. I, I. Billy's already dead. Good job, Billy. I gotta go save Billy. Rob, you're in a little bit of danger. Can we not stand in the the range of the fire? Perhaps maybe if we don't stand in front of its face, we won't get fire blasted. You know. Just a thought. Oh, its weak spawn is right there. I see that now. I had just enough stamina to pull that off. Oh! <laughs> I got crushed, dude. Okay, uh, revive, please. Um, it's casting a spell of some kind. Let me just revive. Oh, that's a lightning spell. Holy shit, I just got destroyed. When a lightning attack is unleashed, the magical energy cannot be contained. Bolts of lightning will branch off and jump to targets in the vicinity, dealing additional damage. Moreover, if a drenched target is struck by lightning, uh, the resulting bolts will be able to approach a wider range. This guy has a lot of health, and I've already used both my wake stones. That does not bode well. You better not be leaving. And he's... And he just leaves. What the hell, dude? Come on, man. I wanted to go for the long game Perhaps there. I wanted to fight it out. Consequence, but Why's he gotta leave me? Favor I use both my One both of my wig stones there too. That sucks. To Yo, Captain, think of the twenty eyes. Danish. Why Billy? Now just why? Gone. Yeah, Billy, I feel like I feel like we got off on the wrong foot because the pawns like stood in front of his face and just got blasted by the fire instead of like walking to the side. So I'm blaming Billy on that. I'm blaming Billy there. 
are arisen. Thank heavens you've come. Mythic Blue, thank you for becoming a member of the channel again. I appreciate it. Again, Welcome back. If you can believe it. Just when almost all of the villagers had arrived as well. Oh, why must these scaly fiends beset us so? Oi, what are you doing standing about when there's work to be done? Jonas, this is the good sir I spoke of. The one who called the Saurians for us. Is that right? Then I expect you to aid us with this mess, stranger. You did it once afore, eh? Only natural you'd help finish the job. My apologies for the chief's temperament. Yet he speaks truly. We have need of your strength. Pray, calm the beasts as you did before, sir. I dare say you are the only one upon whom we can depend. Okay. The Saurians are a stubborn lot. What say we make them think twice about settling in again? Saurians! I Um, the Saurians all right. are no more, I see. That's twice you've come to our rescue now. You're more than a friend to Harv Village, Sir Arisen. You are a hero. Truth Thanks again, Captain. Thanks again, Mythic Blue. Here he is. I found our troublemaker. Jonas, what is the meaning of this? This blasted beastrin went and ventured into Stormwind Cave. How many times have we said none are to tread there? But he just had to poke his nose where it didn't belong. Yes, there are no other players. This is a single player game. You can hire other play pet players' pawns that they create, though. There can be no doubt he's the one who incited the Saurian's attack. Forgive me. I never meant for any of this to happen. <laughs> Trust a beastron to muck things up. Hey. Jonas! Surely there's no need for such talk. Yeah, you would say that, wouldn't you? Seems to me beastrins go causing problems, and we humans are lumped with the job of cleaning up after them. This guy's a little racist. Jonas, please! You're being ridiculous. There! I do apologize. It would seem things have turned rather uncomfortable. But we mustn't let this sour your triumph. You came to our aid when we needed it most, and for that, you have our gratitude, Sir Arisen. I do hope you shall visit us again anon. A rude fellow nice floating torch. Was there a floating torch? I don't see a floating torch. I see one on the ground, but was it floating at one point? I didn't see. Need to visit the palace. Let us Port back to Fiorin. That she might investigate Minister. No, we've already done that. It's already taken care of. That's all done. Now we have to go back to the city and do more of the palace stuff. Where is this? Ooh, that is quite a ways away. That is quite a ways away. I'm kind of sad that dragon flew away, though. I wanted to fight it. I wanted to take it out. Or a box... Yeah, we've got more stuff in the city to take care of, so let's head back there and do all that when we get there. I want to get all the city stuff out of the way, so that way we get into much more interesting stuff. Also, guys, thank you for tuning in for another day of Dragon's Dogma. Hope you're enjoying your time here. Thank you for leaving a like on the video. When it comes to playing uh, new games and bringing new, new types of stuff to my channel, your likes and your comments and, you know, any other support you're willing to show goes a very long way. It really helps out the channel. The channel can't grow without your help, so I appreciate anyone willing to help out. Very Especially when it comes to changing it up. We could pick some now and That's better, Mythic the the Blue. Thank you for re-upping the membership. I appreciate it. No, 
I'll carefully conserve my strength and endeavor to survive every battle by way of You know what? I'm going to hire this uh tactics. I'm going to hire this uh archer. I think Rob is cool, but we need more range. It's been fun, Rob. Have some grapes. All told, I'm rather satisfied with my performance. It will be an honor to serve by your side. Sometimes it's just time to part ways and try something a little yeah. different. It seems we must make a choice. Let us trust in ourselves and proceed with caution. I still don't know how to get that chest. Mm. Okay, there's a gap in that little area right there, like a tiny little canyon. What's happening here? Why, why is combat music playing and why did you buff my weapons? Oh, there was a random Saurian. All right, come with me. Come with me. Oh, the guy has You're an ice saber. Like That's kind of sick. Monster. I'd gladly see you put what I find to good use. Can't decide if I want to play this game or not. I do love a good RPG, but unsure if I have the time. I would say if you want a very similar experience, just get Dragon's Dogma 1. Obviously, the graphics are a little bit lesser because it is older, but it is very similar in gameplay. And you get the beginning of the story, and then when you have more time, you know, by the time you have more time, this game will likely have gone down in price, and you can play it then. Game review so far, I think the art style and graphics are great. Um, I think the NPCs do talk a little bit too much, but it hasn't become annoying just yet. The, uh, the combat is overall satisfying for the larger fights, though some of the smaller fights do get a little bit tedious because, you know, when you run into goblins for the 50th time, a it's just kind of like, okay, dude, I've seen enough of you, so. you know? We'll find a use for it, I'm sure. Uh, I just fought a dragon for the first time, and I found it annoying that it just kind of picked up and flew away after using a couple of uh, vital material. But I think that's just because that was like a story-based thing, and after you do a certain amount of damage, it just goes away. <laughs> At least until a certain point later on, anyhow. Um, story so far, it's pretty predictable political turmoil based on someone being a faker in something. Um, nothing special there, at least not yet. The game performance is like, I am, I'm on a high end rig and for the most part, it's pretty good. But when I do get to the city, there is some, uh, frame drops. I think that's the rundown. I'd wager there's ought to be found here. Let us ponder how best to proceed. Hey, damn squib. Game came out on the twelfth. I don't know what happened. It's fixed anyway. I don't know either. I have no idea. How's it going, Cole? Also, uh, let me be clear about something as well. Like, to, to add to my thoughts here on a review of the game, the microtransaction stuff sucks, but you can very easily play the entire game without them, without, you know, having a lesser experience. Few monsters linger in the city's shadow. I do agree they still shouldn't exist because what? it might have affected the overall game's development process and, you know, the uh, spread of certain items here and there. But the fact of the matter is, is in its standalone state, you can still play the game without them just fine. It was a fascinating tale to take that as you will. Outside the palace were discussing. Possible to minimize dialogue? I think the only way to do that is to turn off voices. Ah, tell is... Her ties to this figure from the... All right, let's see. That's Fulvio down there in the other area. Slip into the palace in the dead of night and search the minister's chambers. Let's make it nighttime and then go do that. Let us make for the palace that she might investigate Minister Allard's chambers. I can accompany you to the castle entrance, Master. 
but no well, I'm gonna we'll sleep so that way Billy's health goes back up to journey. full. When... We must rest. I meant to Those sleep till night, up. son of a bitch. That's alright, we can just sit on a bench. Why'd you not use fairy stone? Because I have a feeling that they're gonna be much more important later on in the game. Come, we've much to be getting on with. I really wasn't that far from the city, so walking back saves on the fairy stone. I have a feeling that I'll want to use them from further away areas later on. Resource management. Out of here. After you, Arisen. They are finite. I'm not sure how finite they are. I don't know if you can find them endlessly, but I do know that you find them mostly in chests, and there are a limited number of chests in the game. I don't know if you can, like, loot them anywhere, if you can craft them. I do not know. But I'm not using them right now because I don't want to uh, use them when they're not really needed, when I can get back somewhere in just a couple of minutes. But know that your return is eagerly awaited. Hold on, I gotta sit on a bench. I gotta make it nighttime. We're not talking about wake stones. We're talking about fairy stones. All right, one more time. It'll be nighttime. There we go. Mythaboo, thank you for 16 months of membership. The crap I had to go through, I'd do it all again. <laughs> That's how special this family is to me. You, Josh, all the mods, and every not cult member. Hey, thank you so much, Blue. You I appreciate it loads. Yes, thank you me. so much. I appreciate it. Right, so this person is having me follow them again. Uh, but the issue is here. I mean, I gotta get to that same spot, it looks like, so I guess we'll just follow them. It works. <laughs> Maybe not all the mods, Elgernon. How you doing, dude? Those as compared to Dragon Age. I mean, there's some similarities in how the, like, the games are, but overall, they're still wildly different. I would say dra you have to see something to consider is Dragon Age is like D&D light. That, that is like Dragon Age is very much so a D&D based experience with hidden dice rolls instead of them being on the forefront. And it creates a lot of shortcuts for the game's mechanics overall. Takes the sentinel posted outside his chambers with him everywhere. There are times when no one's standing watch there at all. This game is not based on DD in any way, shape, or form. The only thing they really share is that you have a squad of people that you can work with and that they're fantasy RPGs. That's pretty much it. Climb. I would assume the chambers are going to be on the second floor. Based on the circle, it's going to be one of these three rooms. What just happened? Uh-huh. I would not presume to know, my lord. However, it must be a highly sensitive matter for the regent kin to request a private audience. I'm enjoying it so far. The game is fun. Oh, perhaps the boy has found what up, Ricky? wise to the benefits my favor can bring. He might just be his mother's puppet, but at least he knows what's good for him. M my lord, if someone were to overhear, 
Oh, unring your hands, you fool. As if anyone in this palace would dare say a word against me. Now, if Wilhelmina calls, tell her to await me in my chambers. I will return presently. Oh, that guy's about to see me. I need to search his chambers. I should back up immediately. Oh, okay. I'm so glad they went the other way. I think if they came this way, I would have been spotted. I will say stealth in this game is very weird, though. It doesn't feel very stealthy. I'm just a man walking around. Not seeing anything of consequence until this door. Aha. Uh -huh. Batali crested letter. Surely none more important than this. I speak of the ascension of the sovereign. Indeed. But that, your grace, would be better discussed in the presence of your mother. Am I going to get spotted if I walk out here? What are you doing in here? I don't mm. recognize you. Guards, seize the ad Son of a bitch. Oh my god. Okay, well, I have been spotted, my guys. My dudes. S dude, let me move. Holy shit. Oh. <laughs> get up, dude. Get up and run. Drink some green juice and go. I think I lost him. I lost them. I need to go this way. In the yeet and plop maneuver. We're not permitted to be here. Okay. Move along. I will move along. No problem. No problem. No problem, sir. Was I supposed to jump out one of those windows or something? Was one of them like slightly ajar? And I just didn't notice. Oh. It seems you've made a decision. Ah, uh, Richard, I couldn't tell you. I have no idea. It's been a long time since I've even looked at the games. Gravity still works. Oh, yeah. You can absolutely face plant, and it hurts a lot. Okay. We're good. We are safe. You? You? Um, was that guy a thief or something? I don't understand. Oh. Hey, Brant. What does this? There is much we ought to tend to, if we are to strengthen Your Majesty's claim as a true arisen. I know this sigil well. It is the crest of the neighboring country. I think it's fun, Pebbleson. A land with which vermin has no official dealings at present. Let me see. It reads, true to our word. We offer you the power of the Godsway. Pray make haste in securing Melv, that all might be made ready ere our plans are set in motion. A meager clue, to be certain. Though, tis clear that the Queen Regent conspires with Batal. This does not bode well at all. Though the political situation is stable at present, much blood has been spilled between Vermund and his neighbor in the past. I fear such a partnership would only portend the drawing of more. At any rate, to see our search has led us to only more questions. Chief among them, what is meant by securing Melv and this God's way? I will investigate these matters as best I can. In the interim, Your Majesty, should you have time to spare, 
Might you make for Melv? Only once we have gleaned a fragment of the Queen Regent's plot, can we begin to thwart it. And ere it slips my mind, pray, take this. Perchance it will help speed you on your way to Melv. Queen Regent Deesa appears to be working in concert with this phase's fellow. But what? Okay. Ring of Accrual. What's that? Increases the max amount of weight the wearer can carry. Well, that's nice. Well, that's good. Um. Hmm. Let me mess that's with my great. storage. We'll pick a new quest and be on our merry way. You can actually mess with the complexion of your characters. Like, I specifically made my character look a lot like me. Uh, like, I've got, fre like, very faint freckles on my cheeks and nose and stuff. The character creator in this game is actually pretty good. It is pretty solid. Does anyone know if Dragon's Gaze is permanent? It says, bears the power to locate Wakestone shards and note their location on your map. Now, it's cool that it notes the location on my map, but is it permanent? That is my question. Because if it's not permanent, then, like, I would want to say I would want to wait to use it for certain moments, right? Mm-hmm. All right, Billy. Let's put all this stuff away, buddy. I don't think we need four on me. Let's put two away. There you go, buddy. You fared all right on the all right. Roads, despite the hour. Let's go ahead and rest till morning, and we'll be on our merry way for the next quest. Tomorrow. You only got one, don't risk it. Yeah, that's why what I'm saying. Like, I don't know if I want to use it and just have like that. If it's permanent, then fine. But if it's not, then I should wait. Come, we've much to be getting on with. Feeling rested, I trust. According to Google, Dragon's Gaze is not permanent. All right, thanks for looking into it. All right. Magistrate is only prepared to leave his cell. Okay, there's that. Sculptor's block. That's down in Batal. Make contact with a mysterious figure who's been shadowing over step. An ornate box. Seems the argument is broken up between a merchant's customer. Seems you should see what the fuss is all about. Let's do that. Hail, friend. Have you a spare moment? I. I've an eye for people, and my instincts tell me you're of trustworthy ilk. Okay. I'm in a bit of a quandary, you see. You're gonna play it alone I'm in the dark? No, no hobby, plans for that. No I didn't like the original. My stead. Fear not. I only ask your name to list as a tenant. You needn't bother yourself with the cleaning, and I don't expect you to stay cooped up. In I have one upgrade on my weapon as is talent. I don't have enough upgrade materials for the next upgrade. I upgraded it. In the second half of stream yesterday, dude. I'd be much obliged if you'd simply consider my husband. And the other materials I need, I don't have. Then come on by and have a look, see. I've taken the liberty of marking the location on your map. Otherwise, I would have. Because I really like these weapons. Mayhap this ladder is here for a reason. Perhaps new discoveries await us. Alright, we'll meet Mildred at her home another time. Ever tried playing Monster Hunter? I've played a little bit. I, I want to say I've played a good, like, I don't know, 50, 60 hours of Monster Hunter. And I will say that I'm not very good at it. And I also will say this game really makes me want to play more of it. I don't think you try the armor at all because I haven't found better armor than this. And, like, this is, like, this is very early game chainmail. I haven't found anything else yet. I could purchase something, but I just haven't really felt the need. The only thing that's outright killed me so far is the dragon. That I encountered earlier. 
which is very much so a story-based thing, and everything else has not come close to doing enough damage to one-shot me. I know what I'm doing, man. I thought so. <laughs> She's not stopped talking of her adventure since she arrived home. You have my sincerest thanks. For Wild Hearts was pretty close to Monster Hunter, yeah. What up, Aaron? That girl's always running off on some fool's errand or other. For all my chiding. Now listen, tisn't much, but I'd fain offer you a discount on my wares. Pray, make good use of it, won't you? Sure. What are you doing? We've not been given leave to rest yet. I brought you something. Okay, this is the surgeon tome thing. Grants upon surgeon specialization, allowing them to use curatives on the Arisen and other allies on their own initiative. Okay, so that's where people are getting that from. That's where they're getting that from. We gotta find this ornate box. Sorry about that, Hawkwind, but welcome back, dude. Yeah, I, I am very particular about using, like, resources and whatnot, but, um... I'm just waiting for, like, better chest armor before I upgrade them. I do like my pants, but I'm just kind of waiting a little bit more time until, like, things start to do a lot more damage to me. When 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 upgrades are required is when I look into it a lot more. Could it be in here? It's fun so far, MAS. Let me read this one more time. What up, Brylo? Hmm. Diabetes sucks, no doubt, man. Don't think you're safe just because you're in the city. Monsters have gotten bolder. Welcome and well met. There's the Rene box. Don't think I've forgotten your dis in my line of business. Patience is key. Do come again. What am I missing? I forgot what this guy said already. Argument's broken up between the merchant and his customer. Perhaps you should see what the fuss is all about. Amidst the bustle and clamor of Vernworth's marketplace, you espy a young man arguing with the proprietor of one of the shops. It seems an argument is broken up between a merchant and his customer, especially what the fuss is about. Okay, well, that circled back to the first part. Not buying. Can you kill NPCs? That's yes. Well. Better to be selective than wasteful. Browsing was enough to scratch the itch, in my case. Aye, got some coin to spare your humble... Sure, dude. It's much appreciated. Just a casual 100 Gs in his pocket. Oh, um, yes? Glindor. Uh, I, I possess no ill intent, I, I assure you. Uh, I merely wished for a closer look at these bows. Oh, okay. Uh, those of other races differ so in design from our own, you see. I cannot deny I am curious about them. That's all it is, mind. Uh, curiosity. Uh, I have no desire to act... Yeah, my beard IRL is a little bit longer than this one in-game. And even if I did, it isn't as if I could purchase one. No matter how they fascinate me. Tisn't to be. Algernon, thank you for uh, gifting Aaron a sub on my Twitch channel. Thank you, man. Very nice. Human made bow. All right, let's uh, let's deliver a bow to this guy. I think I have some bows in my storage, actually. So let me go do that instead of outright buying one. Thanks for doing that, Algernon. Oh. Well, Sorry, didn't mean to hop on the counter there. The fatigue of a long journey when... I should have a bow or two. I do.
I've got three. <laughs> to the foremost, much obliged. Much obliged. What up, go cry? Sounds good, buddy. Thank you for coming by. These foreign bows do so intrigue me, but I shall admire them from a... You would simply give this to me? Oh, that is most generous. I would gladly accept it. Uh, you have my gratitude. Fascinating. Tis not dissimilar from an elven bow in make, and yet tis unlike one in near every respect. Such as this bowstring. It looks quite the same, but the tension is altogether different. I suppose that that comes from using different materials. Well, why do you stare? Perhaps you find it absurd that I should... No, I've not played Rise of Ruin at all. Of elven make. I've watched some gameplay on it. It just doesn't really do anything for me. I suppose I sought inspiration. For I, I confess I find myself rather lost. My aim has suffered of late, such that my wayward arrows simply would not strike true. The timing could not be more unwelcome, as my skill with a bow is to be put on trial anon. Forgive me. I should not expect you to know of our ways. I, I speak of the trial of archery, a time-honored elven custom. Every elf undergoes this trial when they reach maturity. Till we succeed, we are not considered to have come of age. I have been training most diligently, yet my skills ne'er seem to take shape. Indeed, I fear my aim has only worsened with each new failing. I grew so vexed with myself that I sought to learn a foreign form of archery rather than master my own peoples. Thanks to you, I now have the means to do so. Though I dare say I shan't make any headway on my own. Say, would you be willing to give me a demonstration? It might be just what I need to find my aim. Please, sir, you give to me this bow. I only ask that you show me how to wield it. <laughs> I'm not a archer nor ranger, Thanks. but sure. I mean, but this is no place to practice. Would you be so kind as to meet me by the ruins north of Trevo Mine? That's where I train, you see. I'll be able to concentrate on your display of bowmanship much better there. I feel like this is going to be something with, like, the uh, archer maester. I hope you'll join me. For now, I shall bid you farewell. I feel like that would be what's going on there. Okay, now the ornate box. Arisen. So should I just go buy that ornate what box from that, that guy? Story? Twas well told and all, but not particularly exciting, eh? I mean, it's the sort of thing you hear bandied about the tavern every other night, hey, Barge. isn't it? I'd heard tell of a beggar doing well for himself, so I came out here to learn his way. Yo, the sweet. Thank you for Twitch Prime three sure. months in a row. Thank you, dude. I appreciate it. And by the look of it, he doesn't appear to be making much for his efforts, neither. So where's all his coin coming from, then? Like... Treat your ears to a tale by a master storyteller. And should my tale... I got some coin to spare. What would you of me? I'll have no... This is to keep an eye on the storyteller. The only option is to just wait, I guess. Master storyteller. And should my tale entertain you? Nay, even if it shouldn't. I would greatly appreciate a coin or two to soothe my throat with a mug of ale. Now, listen close, as today I shall speak of riddle. <laughs> I appreciate it, Lucid. Frightful mystique. Here's hoping, buddy. In the north of Vermond is our curious tale staged, where ventured a hero off left off the page. He delved into a temple of baleful feature. Only to be confronted by a four-legged creature. Gasp. But when our hero drew his blade, unto him a demand was made. And who the asker? Why, the beast. An uncanny affair, to say the least. Yet there was no time for shock and dismay, as answer my riddle. 
did the fearsome thing say? Hey, that's sick, Lucid. I appreciate it so much, man. To respond meant certain doom. But in the midst of his answer, he'd doubtless be consumed. So a mighty attack did our hero dispense to conquer his foe and banish it thence. With a single strike was the towering beast repelled. My guy is particularly small, Minerazin. And the mortal strength it beheld. Such is the legacy of Lord Rosamond, who, needless to say, was the father of House Berkeley, which lives on to this day. My bed. Gather round, gather round, treat your ears to a tale. Okay, so he just told a whole story. Watch the beggar as he goes about his day and see if you can find out how he makes coin. I mean, he's getting coin from people donating to him, right? For telling his stories? Uh, is there a bench nearby that I can wait at? Over there. I don't want to hear him tell the same story like eight times. Let me just go over here and do a quick wait. Where is this bench? Goes off here. And then go back out there and see if he's still there telling his stories. It is the first time I've noticed him there, so. Ah, see, now he's not here at all. Wait, is that him? This is him. reminds me of Assassin's Creed, where you're, like, stalking people. But I don't think he's going to have the mechanic where he turns around and spots me. Do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do. <laughs> Yeah, he's looking a little like, uh, what's his name? Mel Gibson in Braveheart. He does have that look about him. Is it mean? Does he feel like he's watching you following him? Yeah. He's actually got eyes in the back of his head, and he's watching me very intently right now. Well, stop thinking. That's the problem. I'll collect that. You needn't trouble yourself. Arms, arms for the poor. Pray grant those less fortunate some salvation. The guy I'm following walks at a slightly faster pace than I do. Take a bath then, man. The water's right there. Time to be heading home. Yo, Biggie, 20 months of membership, best streamer community. Thanks for being a part of it, dude. Thanks for being here. I suppose there can be no harm in bringing this along. Okay, so he's talking to a guy. Looks like a little bit of like a... An outdoor bar here. I'd sooner not associate with drunkards. Go. Another day. Um, have a look. Look at him. Aren't you careless fools? Do I need to approach him? I 
Yes, if you start New Game Plus, you keep all of the weapons and armor that you have. Both in your pockets and equipped on your character. He started running. I thought he was on to me and was about to, like, book it up that hill. Rejoice, my darling, for your Albert is returned. Oh. I'm supposed to approach. Welcome home, dear. I spend my days spinning yarns, only to come home to a wife for whose radiance I have no words. If there is a more fortunate fool in the city, I have yet to meet him. Oh, you bold-faced flatterer. Okay. Ingredients are plentiful hereabouts. No I'm gonna open up this box. Hope you don't mind there, my dude. Just gonna take the goods. In my wares. Should I speak to the guy? I'm gonna speak to him. What would you have me? I'll have no All right, I can't speak to him. Well met. I assume you'll be starting off with a mug of the good stuff. Just pass the time a little bit. Okay, this guy has vanished. Son of a bitch. Oh, come on, dude. I didn't know it was going to pass like half the day. Where'd this guy go? That's not him. Son of a bitch, dude. Okay, I really don't like this quest and how it works. Because, like, you're just standing there doing nothing for a while. Like, just, just doing nothing. If you pass the time, the guy just vanishes. That's it. Maybe I stand here and pass the time until he comes back. Maybe I just hang out at the bar for a full 24-hour period. Maybe. Well met. I assume you'll be starting off with a mug of the good... Pleasure doing business. Okay, let's see if he comes back. Well met. I assume you'll be starting off with a mug of the goods. Kill him, quest resolved. <laughs> pleasure doing business with He says pleasure doing business, yet, but no business is being had. I'm just a loiterer. Well met. I assume you'll be starting off with a mug of the goods. Many thanks. Yep, yep, yep. Many thanks to you too. Okay, dude, let me talk to you. Just be sure you Okay, well. Let's wait one more time. Well, man, I think it's going to be nighttime again if I do, though. With a mug of the good stuff. Yep. Many thanks. God damn it. All right. I hate this quest. I'm not doing it. Absolutely hate that stuff. Do not like. Mildred has a quest to make of you and ask you to meet her at her abode if you are interested. Let's go meet with Mildred, shall we? Allow me to lead the way. I can take you to our destination by the optimum route. All right, lead the way, Yamato. Yamato Cannon online. You. You. What should I do? This ladder looks sturdy enough to climb. Perhaps. Here we are. You've come. Glad to see you, friend. Oh, I thought you were the guard over there. I was a little concerned. So, what say you? Would you care to live here in my absence? As I've said, you needn't worry about tending to the place. Okay. Many thanks, friend. I knew I could count on you. I'll stop by again in a week's time, but till then, farewell. Hey, random stranger, you want to live in my house while I leave the city? Aha! <laughs> Surely that's a good idea. To rest in an abode than out in the elements, methinks. Let us make good use of it while we can. Tis as you say. Wait, so this is actually like my house right now? Sick. Ah, how I've longed to. Who says it's you sleeping in the bed, Billy? 
There's one bed. It's like a one twin bed and you take up like two of these. I'm just a wee lad. This is mine now. I could just sleep there for a week, but I'm not going to do that. Um, seems the magistrate is only prepared to leave a cell. Right, there's that. Favio, the Arisen Shadow. Let's go, uh, let's find this guy. Where is he? Is it the guy that, uh, kind of follows me around, specifically at night, that I see every so often? That when I approach him, he yells, you? Is that him? I'll tell you what, let's make it nighttime again. We're going to see if that's the guy. That is my suspicion. An... Josh makes Billy sleep on the floor. He's not your typical house cat, that's for sure. Step lively. Journey by starlight shall make for a nice change of pace. Ready to forge on? Hmm. I guess we just have to be lucky enough to run into him, I guess, at this point. <laughs> Sir, where are you? I ran into him like three times earlier and now I'm not seeing him at all. Of course. That's typical, right? Maybe if I double back? No. Let's just walk around this way. I had a feeling that was going to be the guy. I ran into him a few times already today. I'm hoping that he makes an appearance again. There he is. Come here, you son of a bitch. Come here. You. you. Huh. Boy. Come here. Huh. Hey, where are you going? I'm trying to talk to you, bud. Maybe I just follow him for a while. Hold on, I'm gonna loot this. Pray, allow me to open your chest. You. I mean, but, but uh, I don't understand. I can catch up to him just fine, and then nothing happens when I do. Thanks for being here, Steve. He doesn't really look like they have a pattern of where he's trying to go either. He just keeps running and then he stops at random intervals. We're just going to keep following. Maybe he is actually going somewhere and it just doesn't really make sense right now. Unless I just tackle his ass. Well, that's something. Okay. My, my. I'm trapped like a rat. Yeah, Tro, that was it. Grab him, dude. Both shrewd and fleet of foot. Brian, hope you're having a good weekend too, dude. Why are you following me? What? Can't you think of a reason? I'd thought you were keener wit than that. Let's just say there are some who don't want you wandering about as you please. I was to report on your comings and goings, you see. But I suppose that job's over. Now you found me out? So... How about it, friend? Will you let me go? I've no reason to trouble you any further. Demand compensation. Aye, aye. You'll have your coin. That's how this works, isn't it? Refuse his gold. Greed will get you nowhere, friend. But worry not. You won't need it where you're headed. Oh, what the shit, man? Assassino! 
<laughs> One helm splitter is all he needs. Why are you here, Brant? Shit. We're in for it now. Brant, I had a handle on this. He is an agent dispatched from Batal. Pray, let us handle the rest. We will hear all he has to say before the week is out. I bid you, wait till then. Okay, well, yes, sir. we took care of that business, I guess. <laughs> Helm Splitter does insane amounts of damage, dude. That that attack is so nuts. Mm-hmm. <laughs> All right, I'm going to do this. I'm going to go grab that ornate box from the merchant. I'm just going to buy it from him and see what happens. Fancy a look at my wares? Always a pleasure. Moin. Nice little detail. Since I bought the ornate box, it's no longer on this uh, table. It's mine now. Alright, nothing else happened here. Do I need to use the ornate box? Something small can be stored within the internal compartment. Well, nothing is in there right now, so... Next quest. Alright, wait a few days and speak with Brant. Place to call home the beggar ah, do we wait for the beggar again there's a ladder here i'm taking these these are mine now these belong to me hey man i'm gonna take a nap right here it's too early All right, this guy's back up here again. I'm going to wait one more time. They can be most convenient. Which should get him to start walking away, maybe. Brand took too long to join me on this quest and I killed the guy accidentally. Oof. Did that brick you out of doing the quest entirely then? Okay, this guy is leaving has left he went this way previously that's not him but he did go this way was it up here he was up here up this way i think i'm probably way off Yeah, this goes to the noble quarter. This ain't it. Just yonder looks to be a good spot. All right, again, I hate that quest. Harvesting ingredients. We could. Some of these quests are just not very fun. I will say. Hmm. Slums is over here. That's where he was. Walter's Tavern. Where am I? I went the exact opposite way. Pick some now and use them when the need arises. What happens when you kill NPCs? I killed some merchant beginning of the game. I was hoping to get his loot, but nope, nothing can't loot the merchants, I guess. I honestly have no idea, man. I haven't really gone out of my way to kill many, very many NPCs at all. And that's like a second playthrough type activity that I do for most games that I play. As far as this goes, I honestly have no idea. I do know that if you attack certain NPCs and you encounter them later, they will become aggressive. Um, but that's all I really know. I 
I could use some healing after that. I shall gladly oblige. Wow, the range on that healing spell is kind of insane. Arms, arms for the poor. Pray grant those less fortunate some salvation. Listen up, you lot. Albert, king of beggars, is high. The ale's on me tonight, so. Okay. So he basically rewards everyone with a drink. I'll well, tell you what, bud. I'll have one on you. How's that sound? With a mug of the good no, Never mind. No. I guess I have to pay 2,000 gold for a single drink. Which I assume passes the time. <laughs> oh. We're all having a party. Okay. It was around on me, I guess. What up, Tiger Cloud? How you doing? Are those other players running about? No, this is a single player game. Interested in my boy there. The ale flows up, so never mind your coin purse. Drink your fill. This is generally used as a material. He says drink your fill, and yet when I go to this guy, I have to pay money. Keep those orders coming. This fearsome world of ours is... I'll tell you what, I'll have one more drink and see what happens. Well met. I assume you'll be starting off 2,000 gold is easy to get. Does he want me to get drunk? Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> We are laughing. Nothing's happened. Okay. So do I just wait? Just be sure you might. What would you have me? Oi there, the ale. So never mind your coin purse. Drink. <laughs> so I guess, I guess the solution here, like, realistically, is, like, he raises money, and then he gets everyone drunk on the daily. Like, that's what I'm getting out of this. Alright, one well, more drink. I assume you'll be I'm getting thirsty. Good... Not half bad. I'm getting thirsty. Um, nothing's changed. It's been a hard day. What would you have made? I guess we just got to wait. But I'm afraid if, like, I pass time, he's going to vanish again. I'm not going to know which direction he goes. That's the problem here. So, guys, uh, how was your day? How was your day, chat? We're just going to wait for this guy to make a move, then we're going to follow him again. I will say, it is getting uh, into the evening hours. So I assume he'll make a move soon. Because when it was nighttime, he was gone. You can find dragons in different areas at different times, Storm. I found one to the west. It was a relaxing day for you. Nice, man. I like to see it. I like to see it. Go on, have a look. Day was fine. Had to get the last things for the hike. Okay. Okay. I got up. I had some oatmeal. Apple cinnamon oatmeal, guys. Oof. So good. I start my day with apple cinnamon oatmeal every day, and I love it. I, uh, I then poured over my recent videos, looked at all the analytics, as I do, because I have become obsessed with checking out every analytic possible. I had a little bit of a moment of self-defeatism, but then I realized, you know, doing that doesn't really help my own self out. 
lost a little bit of confidence in myself. I ignored it, and now we're here streaming. <laughs> That's my day so far. Okay. It's getting darker still. Waiting for this guy to make a move. I have a question. What's your wife's favorite games? She's into classic RPGs like, uh, you know, Mass Effect, Dragon Age. As well, she's into things like uh, Elder Scrolls and Fallout. She also likes... She recently discovered that she likes turn-based RPGs like Baldur's Gate 3, but hasn't really pursued that genre too much at this time. And she's also into, like, things like Stardew Valley. She also likes Animal Crossing. Um, not too long ago, she played Bioshock 1, which is pretty cool to see her play. And lately, she's been playing... What has she been playing? She's been playing something. Oh, she's been playing GTA 5. She's been playing GTA 5 for the last few days. Yeah, Discord's been saying she's enjoying GTA 5. Yep. Indeed. Would she romance in Mass Effect? Was it Garrus? She's played enough Mass Effect to where she's... Hold on. Oh, there it is. She's played enough Mass Effect to where she has uh, romanced every possible character. All right, we have action, guys. The chase is on. Bioshock 1 is a mind firk. It's so good, dude. Would you kindly? Um, Wifer again? Yeah, she is uh, as much into Mass Effect as we are. Dragon Age as well. She has romanced every possible romance character in Dragon Age. How does he not know I'm following him? Right, doors locked. That should do it. Okay, so we need to get up to that bridge up there. Never mind, we cannot get to that bridge up there. So, Master, my heart knows no greater peace than when I'm by your side. Seeing that item up there, as well as a door, I'm assuming I can get in from there. But how do I get there? Okay, nice jump, man. My God, you're so good. Yep, this does nothing for me anyway. Sick. Welcome back, Puck. I guess we just gotta wait again. What up, Madcap? How's it going? We didn't take that Yahoo's comment about a thumbnail seriously yesterday. I noticed the difference today. I the <laughs> thumbnail is only different today because I didn't want to use the same thumbnail three days in a row. Knock, knock. If I, if I had made my way home and someone just kept, like, smacking my door, I think I'd be a little upset. What up, Clyde? How's Dragon's Dogma 2 going? It's going well. I just, um, currently stuck on this quest where I have to follow this guy, and now he's, like, locked in this. I don't quite know how to get this going again, unless I just have to wait, which is quite possible by itself. Oh, you know what? Actually, Billy, can you maybe help me? A master has given us an order. Surely you do not intend to disobey. Billy, can you launch me? Is that possible here? I can't imagine this would be required for this quest, though. 
But Billy isn't really understanding it either. Whenever I say help me, Akira just heals me, which is good. I'm glad she does that, but Billy just kind of stands there and looks at me funny. He'd be more willing to launch if you hadn't made him sleep on the floor. Maybe. Maybe I have him launch me up here? Billy? You look awful similar to the guy, but with cleaner clothing on. I'm not accustomed to speaking with strangers in the street. His name is Albert. Uh, what was the other guy's name? Does anyone recall? Didn't it also start with an A? You got rid of the pawn with separation anxiety? I did. I'm going to follow the guy. If I can find him. Was his name Albert? Does anyone remember? I don't know what to do. Of course, I have seemingly lost him. Fuck. Tell him to go. I have told him to go and he doesn't do anything. No harm in picking a few. All right. Go in his house? Okay, I will. Okay. I took the man's clothes, deliver the beggar's garb. Your clothes are mine now, sir. Do I have to make a choice here? Do I have to decide who I deliver them to? Baldwin's Estates or Walter's Tavern? Let's go to Walter's Tavern. I have a feeling like this guy is just duping people. This little area is kind of confusing to navigate. Hey, it took this guy's clothes. This is surely proof that he's duping you all. <laughs> That's how evidence works, right? I went to this guy's house when he wasn't home and took his clothing. Very good. Hi, sir. What I can do for you? What? You mean to say my Albert's a noble and has only been pretending to be a beggar? That... That can't be true. Earning a living in the slums isn't easy, but Albert and I, we promised each other we'd try our hardest to make ends meet. We've been working toward that all this time. And you're saying it is all a lie? I don't want to believe such madness, but... Nor can I deny that these garments I'm on are PC. Husbands. Pray. Tell me where you found them. I must see this for myself. Let me get that. Okay. Gave Selena the beggar's garb. I guess we have to make it back to that spot. Visit Selena in a few days' time. Oh, there's a lot of quests that require waiting right now. Please hold. Okay. A lot of quests require waiting right now. Um, that would that's a wait. That's a wait. That requires us to go to the Trevo mine. I guess we can go do that real quick. By like, real quick, I mean we're just gonna head up that way and see what happens. Um, can we go up this way? Yeah, there's Trevo mine. If we go up this path, that'll be something new to discover. Then we go up here, this way. Okay. Let's go do a little bit of exploring, guys. Shall we? My hand would tremble on the string if to a me. 
but I expect you'll do just a little bit of exploring. I need some action in my Allow life here. The, the vanguard is yours. Lead on. On decay. Hope you're doing well, dude. Thanks for joining us again today. Also, I gotta say that uh, that quest don't like it. Uh, that whole quest, not a fan. Come, I'll lead the way. Okay. Over here, Master. Did you lose sight of me? Yeah, you're so far away. Your current vocation is ill suited to wielding a bow, Master. I suppose tis so. Okay, yeah. I think this quest that I'm about to go on requires me to wield a bow for the whole archery thing, and that makes sense. So I guess we're not gonna do that. I think that's the archer maester. Ranger maester, whatever it is. I had a feeling. I'm gonna go back this way and we're just gonna wait a few days. Played banishers at all? Nah. How's performance in the capital? It's sticking right around 60 FPS, like just at the cusp of it. Where was that building that is uh, temporarily my house? Does anyone recall? <laughs> I didn't actually look at it on the map. Was it down this way? You would think it would be marked. There's a ladder here. Perhaps new discoveries await us above. That's not it. Oi there, friend. Hey. All I ask is that you hear my request. Hear him out. Thanks, sir. As to the matter at hand, it concerns my ox cart business. I've been holding off service on account of all the monsters on the road, but now I feel prepared to start making trips to Melv again. Only trouble is, there are still monsters about, and I can't help but worry for the safety of the carts. That's where you come in. See, I've got a letter here from Lady Margit. Margit? wife to be delivered to one Sir Leonard in Melv. I'd like you to accompany the cart in my stead and see to it that the letter reaches its recipient. What say you, friend? Okay. Splendid. I knew I now. The carts only depart at certain hours of the day. But I find that time fl And mind you, don't forget to pay your way before you board. That's standard practice. Each cart travels with an escort of trained soldiers, see? In case it encounters any monsters. So anyone thinking of riding for free will have to take the issue up with them. But enough of my lecturing. Just so, oh, and I'll pay your fare this time. Seeing as you'll do come find me when you deliver that letter. I'll be waiting to hit. We all see this to its destination. Okay. We'll do that after we do the other thing. Is it close to the end, was it? Let's go up that way and take a look. Spent so much time in the city doing all sorts of random shit already today. I cannot remember I've where this house was. I've just a little tidbit I heard from the locals. Rose married to the fell omen, yeah. The military's makeup. I've heard the same. There's the diviner. Indeed. Tell is, there's been a shift in the chain of command. This isn't my house. This isn't my house. This isn't my house. <laughs> I'm just gonna barge into every house and wait. Yeah, just see if any of it belongs to me. Does anyone 
Elgernon, do you know? You've played this game a bunch, right? Where the hell is that? Why is it not marked on the map? Maybe... Maybe if I highlight the quest? There we go. That helps. Never mind. I've got it. Jeez, man. I was close, yeah. Getting proper rest is an important. We're just gonna wait a whole bunch of days, just so we can Our get these other quests continues. going. Come, we've much to be getting on. I have no issue. For we'll wait three or four more days. Time of day. We're going on a sleep bender. Very good. This is what depression looks like. Uh, where all you'd want to do no, is sleep. Just to pass the time. And there. Don't like the waiting? No, I don't either. Getting proper rest it makes sense in certain instances, like having a quest here and there do it, but having three where you have to wait? It's a little strange. Uh, how I... Okay. That woman never came back. I'm going to wait another day and see if she shows up. Hold on. Hold on. What's this? Had I not encountered your majesty when I did, I fear this nation would have been led down a false path. My gratitude to you and whatever power orchestrated our fortuitous meeting knows no bounds. I believe you are more than worthy of this token of my esteem, and I pray it will be of aid to you on the long road ahead. Brants. Steeled Virtue. That's a sword. Okay. Well, let me give that to Billy. And see if he can wield it. A nice little upgrade for him. Which means I think this weapon will be worth upgrading. So we'll go do that. But also, isn't it kind of weird to leave, yes, <laughs> leave a sword it's hanging important. by my door? That seems kind of ominous. Mildred's week of wandering is up. Okay. There she is. Good tidings, friend. How have you been keeping? Grand. As for me, I made the most of my week-long sojourn. One might even say I enjoyed myself over much. Oh, yeah? But you see... I grew so fond of the destination my feet carried me off to, methinks I should like to live there. And that's when I thought, mayhap you've grown just as fond of this dwelling. What up, game over? Fond enough to purchase it from me? Much. Just give it to you, mind. I've my relocation costs to consider, but I'd sell it to you cheap as I can afford. All right. Well, friend, what say you? 20,000 gold. Okay, you know what? That's as long as 10 rests at, at an inn. This is like the main city, so sure. Screw Much it. Obliged, friend. I hope you're as pleased with our deal as I am. This little dwelling's all yours now. I suppose I'd best be off. I've my Okay, does it mark it on the map for me now officially though? Like will I have a marker here forever? I do. There is a little house marker. Okay, well no we have no longer use of staying at the inn. That's good news. Let me make it over to the blacksmith to level up Billy's weapon now. Need to head west. Look at that guys, we have our own little house. Worth waiting for. I can access storage and everything from there too. That's sick. An ox cart ought to make our journey easier. Are you in the market for something in particular? Enhance equipment. Billy's steeled virtue. We need more of those horns. I think that's the same material. Yeah, I have not encountered these knackers at all, but I need. A total of six horns for this stuff now. 
No, the upgrades for these are cheap. I guess I'll grab the first level. Bonsoir, Chibanster. Okay, we can easily afford these upgrades. I guess we'll just do it. Just to do it. Putrid Gold Tooth. I only have three of those. Whatever. Asp Toxis Scale. We got those way earlier in the game. Haven't gotten them since. Ogre Spurs and Saurian Scales. Fine. Okay, these upgrades are cheaper than I originally had thought. Maybe this is why I have so much money. Can you get Billy a tree house? Would that I could, man. We got those harpy pinions. All right, well, I guess we just need to find some of these knackers to get their horns. I have not seen these things at all anywhere, so. Always a pleasure. I guess I should have investigated, like, those upgrades sooner. I thought they were going to be much more expensive than they actually are. Okay, now, let's return to Brant. Ten pints or a house? <laughs> I know, right? Barman, keep them coming. <laughs> Can I scale this? Oh, hell yeah. Parkour, baby. Right, he's only here at nighttime. Listen, you just did a bunch of waiting. Do some more waiting. There he is. As a reward for your Screw that candle. Efforts, you have been invited to attend the coronation. To it seem, congratulations are in order. You will, of course, require Raymond befitting of the occasion. I would ask that your majesty return once you've procured such attire. Right. Well, I'll tell you what, we'll do that a little bit later. I... Wait. That's not the same quest. There is much we ought to tend to. Captured ah, agent. Yes. Regarding your pursuer from some days past, as we suspected, he was indeed an agent from Batal. What up, Bunny Wizard? Hey, Juan. When he learnt of your majesty's escape, he began inquiring after your movements. Tis a glad thing we captured him before matters escalated. As to how he learned your majesty's location with such ease, I intend to extract the answers from him anon. I shall be sure to inform you when I do. Pray. Take this. Tis the least I can offer for your majesty's assistance. So the agent was of Batal after all. Tis there is much we ought to tend to. If we are to strengthen your majesty's... Do not forget that we work to serve... All right. Now. All right. Ox cart courier. Let's go do that. That'll take us to a whole new area, and I'm sure we'll fight some stuff along the way. Maybe we'll find some of these other monsters I need for their upgrade materials, too. Oh, yeah? You thinks? Do you update change the look? What do you mean, Puck? As in, like, the way my character looks?
I think that's something you actually have to pay for, I believe, which is kind of cringe. Um, who do I talk to about this? I guess not Jose. This ox cart's bound ah, there he is. Go into Melv. Ox carts are relatively safe means of traveling between the towns. Their services are available at regular intervals for a fair sum of gold. You only need to visit an ox cart station, pay the fare, and climb aboard. The ox will do the rest. How you spend the journey is up to you. You can enjoy the scenery rolling slowly by or doze off and make the road feel much shorter. Ox carts, raids, and monster attacks are not unheard of, however, so it is always advisable to prepare for battle just in case. Okay. It's this way. And let's doze off. Now, the guy said that there's likely going to be some monsters on the path, so... Okay, there's a Cyclops. Hello there, sir. Alright, climb up to his face and stab his eyeball. As one does. Massive damage. Get me out of there! He's not pleased with me. Time to scale the monster again. Stab him in the eyeball. Sick. I love how they took out the Saurians while I just kind of soloed the Ogre. Or, I'm sorry, the Cyclops. Okay, now, um, where's the ox cart? Did it leave without me? Shut up, dude. Where'd the ox cart go? There it is. Shall we see if there's all to be found while we're here? Yeah, I mean, there's goblins nearby, so. Camera, please. Well, what is this? What is this ability? I guess we'll walk ahead on the path and just see if anything's in the way. There's a cave in the vicinity that you've yet to explore. I can take us there using knowledge I gained beyond the rift. No, I can't right now. I'm on a quest. Sorry. No sense letting the enemy gain the upper hand. I just straight up one shot that goblin. There's more back here. Where did you even come from? I just run right by them? <laughs> Saw that bug out of the corner of my eye. E Yoink. Dare I say it? We trounced our foe. Well and true. Well and true. Is an enemy in and of itself. Let us instead strive to better ourselves with every battle. See, that's what I like to see. Come to think of it, 
We're all of differing vocations, aren't we? Our respective abilities are unique as well. We I'm gonna go ahead on the path a little bit and see if I can skills. find any more of these uh, of trades, monsters of out here. Saw something up to the left. Oh. These are not enemies. Alright, let's go back to the ox cart and then do some more waiting then. Looks like the path is pretty clear for a while. What this? We have found a material. Cinnamon bark. A different mm. combinations of materials result in different creations. This oxen cart is entirely too slow. Did it actually regress in its position? No, it's, it's barely moved at all. I think it only moves if I'm in the vicinity. Let's hop on board and we'll do some more waiting. Oh, there we are. Look at that. We're in Melv. Ah, uh, here we are. The ox got made it without too much trouble. There are worse ways to travel, I suppose. Uh, there's a dragon here. A dragon with really bad acne. What the hell? <laughs> oh, is that her? Is that the girl? That's Ulrika. Get, Get the dragon! Yep, just as I thought, you gotta stab the acne. Oh god, not a good time for no stamina. Oh, we're going up. And we're coming down. I held on tight, we're doing fine. Billy, you died again, you fool. Dude, climb up. How clunky is the climbing on this? Okay. Get out of the way, guys. Get out of the way. You didn't get out of the way. Wake up, Billy. Oh, get out of the way immediately. Does it have more acne that I can go at? Yeah, right there. He just knocked me off. Oh, I'm almost dead. Heal me. Thank you. Ah, oh, we scared it off. Okay. Hey, okay, that's a mystic spear hand right there. Hi, Ulrika. It me. It was a lesson in determination. 
Josh Dr. Pimple Popper. Yes. I do take care of the dragons around here Somehow by popping their pimples. You have my gratitude as well, sir. Ulrika, glad I am to see you unharmed. You must return to the village. Everyone is concerned for you. Forgive me. I'd best go. But I shan't forget this. Thank you. Truly. No Let problem. That. that wasn't the dragon, but a poor imitation of it. No wonder I feel so hollow. Okay. Nice, uh, nice weapon there, bud. I think it's pretty sweet. Ask about the manner of his fighting. It is a style all my own. Can I learn this style? A patchwork of techniques honed for the sole purpose of slaying the dragon. Unlock the mystic spearhand vocation. Yo, that sick. That was the dragon, Sigurd. You're the current arisen, aren't you? I pray you do not walk the same path as I have. It is a style or the patchwork of technique. Okay. Now, what is my quest here? See Market's letter to its recipients. Okay. Need to go to uh, an inn. I can see if I can change up my vocation. I kind of want to try Mystic Spearhand. Kind of want to try that. These writings could be of import. Let's have a look then. Hello? Here at the inn, I get so few customers, you see, that I can manage both roles myself. Acquire for 200 DCP. Duo spears. Only the Risen can excel at this vocation. A melding of magic and physicality. Their ceaseless attacks leave no room to counter, ticking down foes in moments. Unlock Mystic Spearhand vocation. Change the vocation? Yeah, let's try it out, dude. Fundamentals of battle. Mystic Spearhands wield both magic and the duo spear, enabling them to fight at range and in close quarters with equal ease. Their ability to halt the enemy's movement with charge burst of magic makes a swift offense their best defense, for they have few means of evading attacks at their own disposal. Only the Arisen can acquire this vocation. Redoubted Bolt, holding down right bumper to charge up your magic before unleashing Redoubted Bolt will halt the enemy in their tracks, giving you an opportunity to bombard them with attacks till they recover. The longer the charge time, the longer the enemy will be restrained. Magic can be charged up while moving and attacking, but its stamina only recovers while stationary. Follow-up attacks. When you land an attack using Y, it'll change to a powerful successive strike if the target is knocked down or knocked off balance or the target is not expecting the attack. The powerful successive strike should be carefully aimed as they leave you vulnerable. Okay. But enough of that, me. Setching blade. Hold on, what's dragon stab? Oh, it's just like a charge. Okay. Well, let me buy this. Throw that there. Scattering bolts. Disperses for betting bolt after it has been unleashed and snaring hostile targets in the vicinity and preventing them from moving. Targets struck directly are restrained for longer. Did you need something? Organized storage, deposits. Let's put those away for now. We can always pull them back out later. Need to put more stuff away, my god. Do come again. Curious about how this is gonna work. As a mystic spearhand master. It is thrilling to oh, is... ponder our future battles. Oh, the issue is it gave me a whole bunch of extra armor and stuff, I'm just realizing. Down That's why I'm so heavy. Favor. Here at the inn, I get so few customers, you see, that I can manage both roles. 
I just upgraded that stuff too. God damn it. God damn it, man. Myself. But enough about me. Did you need to come again? Yeah, New Game Plus goes by real fast. This is an outrage. Everything's fine, relax. Now, uh, to deliver the thing. May have this time I went looking for. That place puts my ears on it. Yet the group to befall him. Let me read this. I think I need to deliver this uh, letter to a woman, right? Lady Margit? Oh, Leonard. Deliver the letter to Leonard. Well, who the hell and where the hell is Leonard? Didn't I run into a Leonard earlier in the game, too? Let me speak with you, if you have anything good. Well met. Hello, Dudley. Ring of aggression, boost strength, ring of resolution. Where is less likely to be knocked down or staggered? I'm going to buy ring of aggression. Pleasure doing business. Now let me go over to the items. Going to give Ring of Exaltation to Billy, because he, he needs it more than I do. He dies a lot. Throw that on, man. Get some more health our going. Are heavier, and our purse is far lighter. Certainly arisen. Now heal up. How might I be obeyed? I was hoping you would do the AoE heal for Billy, too, but that's fine. Now, Leonard. Hey. Ulrika. Is my lantern still on? Another merchant? Well met. Looking to make a perk. Hope to see you again. This is Mystic Spearhand. A solitary shard is good for little. We need to seek out more of these, if tis to be of use. Oof. We must take care not to throw it away by mistake. Kind of wish it would just show me the location of Leonard so I could just give him the damn thing and move on with my life, but... That's a lot to ask for right now, apparently. Unless that's him right there. Which also makes sense. Wasn't sure yes. I, what can I do for you? Stand and deliver. Ah, a letter from Lady Margaret, you say? She's a kindly sort, I must say. We met when I worked with her husband, Sir Gregor, on one occasion. Now she's taken to inquiring after my health at the turn of every season. Shall we report our results? All right, we delivered the letter to Leonard. And now I think the quest takes us back to the city. It does. However, what we can do... Um... I was thinking maybe we could find, like, a path down this way, but there is no path down this way. Maybe we just go through... All that wilderness anyway? Just to explore and maybe level up this vocation a little bit? Get into some fights? Some risky business? I'm gonna go north first. Where are you going? Later. I'm leaving. So I think the way this game works, like, it, it says it's open world, but it, I really do feel like it's, it's, as much as it, like, feels open world, it also feels pretty linear, because, like, you're forced into these paths. 
you don't get a whole lot of room to just kind of stray off the path in a lot of ways. You're just kind of stuck going down the pathways. It's weird to me. I feel like you can go anywhere. Yeah, exactly. Like it's it's it, it's called open world, and yet this happens. The wind and sudden as a thunderbolt, I shall endeavor not. Harpies, be on your guard. We need no All right, Archer. Wait. We have the strength to oh, dude, did my friend. Archer die? No, my my mage isn't with me. There it is. Oh, Billy's about to get dropped off that cliff. Later, Billy. <laughs> Come on, dude. Archer, shoot them. Are you kidding me? Good God, man. Oh, good. You went and grabbed him. Good job, Akira. I could feel so alive. Well, I'm glad you're feeling alive because you were feeling awfully dead a moment ago. <laughs> that harpy picked you up and dropped you off, dude. We have any mods here right now? Any moderinos? Hey, this bridge was not fixed earlier. Are the enemies repetitive? Sometimes. Oh, sorry guys. I've beds to spare if you're looking for lodgings, and if you'd like to check, always a pleasure. Very good, Screamer. I just didn't know if these guys are, like, being, uh... Usually when you see a bunch of stuff like, like that in chat, it's not good, you know? I'll take on... Border Watch Training Grounds. No horse in the game? No. There is no mounts. We're running low on everything. From provisions to we've had our time. But I think that's fine. I don't think this game needs mounts. Like I said, this game to run an errand for me. Glad to hear it. It ought to be somewhere north of here. And in the Okay. and he'll take care of the Let's do this. Provisioner's notes. I just don't think that every game needs mounts, and this game does very fine without them. At last we've arrived. Delivery in hand. I only hope the recipient is pleased with our work. I quite agree. Ever move that griffin you crashed on? No idea. No, no idea, man. Sunset draws near. The ears pricked. It will be difficult to pinpoint distant foes by sight alone. No mercy. I will protect you. Are there more? Yes. Let my magic grant you an elemental boost. Yo, that stun's kind of OP.
Hey, Brom. Hold on, guys. Just a moment. Ah, oh, I'll take that. We might find a use for it. We've arrived, just as planned. That's everything assembled. A job well done, if I do say so myself. <laughs> yeah, great job hiding there, Oi. man. Did you need something? This is from Sir Geoffrey, is it? Fine. He wants these as well, does he? I thought I was finished. Why should I have to do all this on my own? I've got plenty to carry as teas. Say, your arms look free. You can handle that list in my stead. And make haste. I would depart for the encampment even a moment sooner. Well, go on. You know what to do. You know what to do. High and low. Um, procure some harsh buds and salubrious drafts. The items on this list can be crafted by combining certain materials. Yeah, okay. I mean, I put a bunch of harsh buds away in my storage. And I happen to know where they can be found. Okay, go. I can guide you to the place arisen, or thereabouts. I will follow you. God is yours. Lead on. DM'd? Alright. Just yonder looks to be a Let me take a look, guys. Hold on. Oh yeah, that's fine, Screamer. <laughs> Good spot for they were looking to get a rise, and so it's just best to get rid of them. We collect as much as we can carry. I see a little alternate path here. Hold on a moment. That is a way down, not a way up. Damn. Thank you, Screamer. Of course, maybe I just have enough stuff to just kind of flat out deliver it anyway. Over here, if you would. Oh, I will follow you, Yamato. Yamato Cannon Online. I can't help but say it. Making our report ought to be our next priority. Okay. Would have seen it sooner had I not been watching out for a giant goddamn lizard who wants to French kiss me. Oh yeah? Are we talking about, like, the lustful Argonian? Is that what we're speaking about right now? I gotta bring it back to the other guy. The Lustful Argonian. Your respect? I unlocked Mystic Spear Hand like 15 minutes ago. I've been liking it quite a bit, Tanner. It's a good time, man. Have arrived. How goes it? Oh, the Xenomorph who keeps popping out of vents. I see you. Brilliant. I knew I could count on you. Here, take this for your trouble. I'll be heading back to the encampment now. Waking powder. Gee, thanks. Okay, we gave Marcus the provisions. What is my active quest now? Oh. <laughs> so not only do I have to like return stuff to him, but I have to go back to the uh, 
military encampment and talk to the original guy too. Sir Marcus was well pleased, Master. Shall we report our success to Sir Geoffrey? If you would be so kind as to follow me, I shall take you to the one you seek. Most far, Grinny and Maid wasn't anything special. Pretty boring read, actually. Well, I mean, compared to what you can find on the internet, sure, but they did the best they could for a game while keeping it under a certain rating, right? For the sake of sales, I guess. We're here, and none the worse for wear. Oi, many thanks for passing on that lift. As I hear it, you even assisted him in gathering the supplies. Anyway, you've been a great help. I hope I Our efforts have seen the encampment. Okay, we did that. Now, once again, I, um, let's go inform Donovan. Let's just make our way back to the other town. It's kind of, um, I don't think I like the way the map works in this game. Like, it calls itself open world. We had this, 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 this discussion a little bit when this game first came out, and I knew, I felt it right away. It calls itself open world, and yet is actually linear. It's just very linear paths with small things that you can explore here and there. It's not open world at all. It's just a giant open linear well, map, if that makes this. sense. I'm only glad I don't have to it's kind of disappointing in that chain. regard. Don't call yourself open world without actually being truly open world. If you're looking for lodgings, and if you'd like to change your vocation, a, good sleep a little bit frustrating. Prepared for the morrow. Hey, thanks for 200 likes on the video, guys. I appreciate it. Look at that. He defeated a griffin. What a guy. Came back with a fish and a green warish. I served one, master. I trust we've all inspected our equipment. Off we go then. Ready to okay. forge on. Now, guys, real quick before I go back out on the path here to make my way back to their town, I'm going to take a quick break because I have to pee. We'll make our way back to the uh, city area there and see what comes next. Also, when I get here, I can take this alternate path just to see what's going on over here. I've not been there yet, so we can do that. But anyways, I'll be right back, guys. Don't go anywhere. All right, we back. I see new companions. Yeah, I think I've got to replace some of them soon, but for now, I'm just keeping them around. How you doing, RFI? Shout out to the player who used my pawn and gave me a rotten beast steak as reward. Yeah, I feel like the reward system may as well not exist. <laughs> Uh, Hades, I've not played Hades yet too much. I've played a couple rounds of it. Uh, I do have it. I think it was gifted to it by Screamer. But I haven't spent too much time on it yet. Pray, follow me.
All right, so we're going along this path back to the main city. Oh, hey. A thief's agility makes them a tricky opponent. Try not to let them get the other hand. One cannot be too careful. I grant you glory, Flesh. Yo, that stun is OP against regular enemies. That stun is very OP. Do 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 do. Sorry, dear. You have my protection. All right, well, the seshing blade just kind of auto targets them. Yasin, how you doing? Well fought. There's no one standing who might say otherwise. No doubt this triumph will spur us into the next. Well fought, Avoid flame at any cost arisen. You have been doused in oil. All right, I can actually stun things that are flying around too. That's good. I will say though, I do miss the idea of dashing around with the There's a cave in the vicinity that you've yet to explore. Oh, let's go to the cave then. I can take us there. Using I do miss I the thief. The I see a ladder yonder, but we can't reach it from here. We'll have to get up there and drop it down. Well, there's no way I can make that jump either, so I gotta be able to access that from a different spot, I believe. There's just no way. Oh, that was a rotten scrag. Whoops. Now, what might that be? We ought to take a closer look. <laughs> okay, well that just blasted him right in the face. On the new weapon, did you change your character? Same character, just different um, vocation. Well, I guess here comes the real test.
Uh-oh. I am definitely taking these hits. Uh-oh, it's going to charge. Get out of the way. Get out of the way. Get out of the way. Where did it go? Oh, there's a griffin above. No. Where did the minotaur go? There he is. Oh. I saw the griffin's shadow, but I don't see it. I need stamina recharge here. Okay, multiplayer? No. Big hit there. Hey, how my character got turned around there. Yep, just finish it off. See ya. what's interesting is we actually broke his horns I, I found one of the horns on the ground to pick up that's pretty cool Efficiency at its best indeed it was enough to make one pity our foe okay now uh about that griffin i saw the griffin there it is is it still circling us i think it's still circling us everyone's full health Yeah, it's still circling us. It's looking for an opportunity to strike. There it is. Get out of the way. Our prideful foe thinks itself safe in its right. Then it's dragged to the ground and teaches the error of the way. Small problem. Wait a minute. Here it comes. I think it's out of range for me to hit it with my bolts. Oh god, there's a cart here. Oh, that was some huge damage, dude. Okay, that hurt a little bit. Okay.
Holding on tight. Oh my damages, dude. Holy shit, that was awesome. All right, he's enraged. He's a little pissed off. Get out of the way. Okay. Uh, panic heal. Come on, heal me up. Here comes the lightning spells. Get out of the way. Akira, no, move. Big hits, big hits. Oh, it's angry. Oh, I fell off. Son of a bitch, no stamina. Dude, I am stuck underneath you. All right, make it up to the face again. Good stuff. Now this is a fight, guys. This is a fight. Hit it with a big damage. All right, final health bar. Big damage is here. Hop off before stamina is too much of a problem. Don't you dare fly away. Oh, is that a knockdown? It is. Finish it. Yes. Griffin defeated. Let's go. Dude, these big fights are so Monster Hunter-esque. I love it, dude. I love it. That's so exhilarating to me. That was sick, dude. Come, I'll lead the way. Damn. <laughs> that was awesome. I love it. Woo. Hey, what's up, Adler? Just want to say, keep it up, man. Love your streams and vids. I will be watching from start now. Yo, Adler, thank this you way, so master. much. I appreciate the kindness, dude. Thank you. Certainly arisen. How might I be obeyed? <laughs> right in the pecker, true. <laughs> yep, I kept stabbing it right in the face. Dude, the uh, the magic cut, whenever an enemy is knocked down, when I press Y, it does massive damage because it does like a special uh, critical hit animation. That's actually really strong. That is insanely powerful.
Yeah, that special critical hit animation is very strong. Holy shit. You like a Mystic Spearhand? I am. I am a lot. Basically, I get like a stun on them. I can just stun them. That's why they flash blue because I'm shooting them with this bolt. When I do that, I get a special critical hit animation like that. It also works if the enemy is knocked down on the ground like I did with that griffin back there. So as long as I can like make an enemy unsteady or just knocked down on the ground or stunned, then I get that massive damage spike. I enjoy that. It is a good time. Which vocation does the most damage? So far, the most damage I've seen this from a singular attack is on Gut and Run on the Thief. We'll say we make things easier when also, uh, Helm Splitter does a massive amount of damage on the Thief as well. Say. But I will say that my overall experience is pretty limited because yeah, I've only played Thief and uh, Mystic Spearhand so far. I have to imagine if it's anything like the first game, then the, uh, I think it's the Sorcerer that gets access to the Tornado ability. That ability does insane damage, too. Good job. Is there, is, there, is there more? Apparently so. Alright. There we go. There we are. Yon path leads not to our destination. If you would prefer to explore, I shall guide you another time. Uh, perhaps the Arisen has recalled some more pressing business. Fret not. I'm yes, sure I am on more pressing business right now. There's a path I want to explore. We're actually getting closer to it now that we're crossing this. This right down here is where I want to go. We get there from nearby the Riverside Ruins. We can, we can check out up this way a little bit. Those paths end there, so I... I don't know what the deal is there, but either way, there's this road here, too. I want to see what's over there. See if there's anything interesting happening. Your spear clipping through the cave is kind of bothering me. I mean, you've played enough video games, I'm sure. Clipping exists in every game, man. It's just how it is. It's getting better all the time, though. In fact, the two games I've seen it do do it best recently are this game as well as uh, Enshrouded. But just because they do it, you know, well doesn't mean it's perfect. Oh god, I'm sleepy. I'm sleepy. Mind of Deb, hello. Hope you're doing well. Good to have you back. Centipede, welcome back as well. I am enjoying Dragon's Dogma too. It is a good time. It is indeed a pretty good time so far. Stop 
goblins, master. Can't leave it. Let my magic grant you an elemental thing. Dead end run. We need not waste our strength. more that I'm not seeing? Yes. There are worse places or have you noticed most of you are versus the one not playing? Yeah, yeah, for sure. Oh god. Sliding all the way down. Got him? Okay. What am I... Oh, hey. Feeling like Darth Maul out here right now. This is generally used as a material. I'm sure we'll find a purpose for this. Oh hey, <laughs> I almost started swinging at that guy. Whereabouts am I? We should be close. Yeah, I want to go across here and then in relation to that, check out some new stuff. I call on you to carry the burdens we cannot. I must thank you. Your toil keeps me light on my feet. Don't know how I feel about running everywhere. Uh, there is no mounts in this game, but like there is fast travel and. You know, fast travel is weird how it works in this game. It is limited, but you find more and more of the tools as time goes on to do so. And I, I've not really, I've not even used fast travel myself at all yet at this point in the game. I'm a little over 10 hours in. I've not used fast travel at all. Um, but that's be largely because, like, when you're playing different vocations, like, you as your character can play as all vocations in the game. What am I hearing? Ah, oh, there it is. You as the player character can play as all the vocations in the game. And because of that, you want to make use of being able to fight as many enemies as possible. So this way you can level up and get more experience on the vocations. So that way you can just get better skills and whatnot. Oh, um, into the water with us, I guess. Sick. <laughs> now, about Billy. Forfeit main pawn. If your main pawn becomes forfeit, you need to only touch a riftstone to return them to your side. Okay. We fell in the water. Me and Billy were just hammering on that guy's forehead, so we just kind of ended up dying. What is that mark? Design the way so you're fighting all the time? Yeah, so that way you constantly get vocation level up, so that way you unlock more skills. 
Now, that doesn't mean that you have to go around fighting every little thing, but it does help your, uh, your overall character out to do so. Just yonder looks to be a good spot for harvesting ingredients. Oh, Shall yeah? we see if there's all to be found while we're here? Alright. We are a man down because Billy fell in the water alongside me. Small problem there. You stop running. <laughs> oh, I like that little wave that comes out of my weapon. Yeah, trying out the first game is definitely a good way to go too because it's pretty much the same thing here, just older. I'll collect that. You need and therefore cheaper. Oh, that looks like Blizzard. Get out of there. Warrior. There's another one. I didn't see you there. Okay. A lot of Saurians out this way. Alright, so I, uh, I'm going to head back down this way. We're going to check out the rest of the southern part of this path. A common reward. Frustratingly so. We cannot expect gleaming treasures around every corner. Why not? Master, I discovered a treasure chest hereabouts during my last journey beyond the rift. Okay, show me Shall the way. I guide you to it? Allow me to lead the way. I should like to put my knowledge to good use. We're in your hands, sir. Show Not me where the chest is. We've arrived, just as planned. Nice, good call. Hey, not bad. 1210 Gs. We take those. Take care by the river's edge. Love this vocation, go ahead and try it out. Yeah, it's actually a really good time. Uh, we have Zombos.
One might confidently call that a resounding victory. We mustn't allow ourselves to become complacent. Skeletons? Take More skeletons. With a big stick. Let my magic draw you an elemental boon. My curates of magic are at your disposal. Wait a moment. Why are you running from him? It's fine. He died before the blast. Oh god, I'm in the flamethrower range. Is that all? There's more. Never mind, good job. You got him. Let us try for the same results with our next attack. Hey guys, another venturing party. I'd wager they ought to be done dead. Have risen to face us. Get up. I just kind of walked out of the way, and she ended up getting smacked for it there. My bad. Yeah, the uh, combos this class already pulls out are kind of sick. Look at that shit, man. That's kind of sick, dude. Oh, I think that was the tower I climbed earlier in the game to get to the... Oh, no, it's not the same one. I say I climbed up this one to get an arbalest, but... Hey, bud. How you doing? You guys got any loot down here? It is not how we use this, but when that counts. I imagine it would be most Hey Dab, thanks for watching on Twitch side as well. Dash in midair? Um not that I've seen. Do I like the game? I do enjoy the game. As far as recommending to buy it, I mean again, I would say try out the first game. Just because it's uh it's cheaper but plays very, very similarly. I, um, I have a hard time recommending the game, not because of the quality of the gameplay. The gameplay is good, but the issue that I have recommending it is that it does have some pretty predatory ideas behind it as far as microtransactions go, which kind of sucks. They kind of sprung these microtransactions on everyone last minute, so no one knew about it until, like, the day before release or something, which was kind of shitty of them to do. And by kind of, I mean extremely. So it just depends on your own view of that and whether or not you can, like, look the other way on it. Oh, also, it does have performance issues on console. It's locked at uh, 30 FPS, or if you have, like, a variable refresh rate on, the max I've seen people get is 45. Which, 45 FPS is not good looking. I would rather play at 30 than 45. 45 is kind of janky. But I've always felt that way about variable refresh rate. Like, having it fluctuate between certain numbers just makes it look weird. But I will say, the gameplay itself is a really great time. I... I am loving the gameplay, especially when you get into, like, these massive fights against these huge monsters. It plays a lot like Monster Hunter, actually. It's Monster Hunter with more realistic character animations, if that makes sense. Because Monster Hunter has, like, this high fantasy thing going on where there's just, like, ridiculous combos, which are fun, too, by themselves. But these, the uh, what happens in this game is, like, a better... I, I don't know, better isn't the right word. A more realistic flow of combat. So 
not calling this game realistic at all, but as far as like the actual characters work, it has a little bit more of that realism feel to it. The combat is very chunky, for lack of a better way to describe it. What I mean by this is it's, um, it's very weighty. You feel the impact of all of your attacks, which is awesome. Well, there are moments when it can get a little button mashy in the combat as well. Like when you're trying to deal a lot of damage, you just keep like spamming X or something. That does happen. Where is this guy? I can't find it. Did you guys get the ghost? Uh, this is a single player game, Tim. And yeah, the microtransactions aren't required to play the game whatsoever. They're not. It doesn't mean they don't suck for existing, but you can play the game, you know, without it just fine. I can't reach it. I hate this ghost right now. Oof. There we go. Smacked it up a little bit. No auto lock? No, there is no like lock on. It's not really needed for this at all though. It has like um like its own like built-in targeting system that works quite well. The archer kill the damn ghost. The archer's the only one that can hit the ghost reliably. I think it's annoying. Would that such tranquility could last? Right you are. Okay. And there we are, back on the main path again. Good stuff. I guess we can explore this path to go to this other entrance again, since I would like to clear it out, so let's do that. Those NPC followers? Yes, they're called pawns. You can have three of them on your team at any one time. good. Oh no, Bunny Wizard, I'm not, I, the whole reason microtransactions exist is because people do indeed buy them, yeah. I'm not debating that idea, but it doesn't, like, again, it doesn't mean it doesn't feel bad. 
The fact that they exist and continue to exist is because people are very hypocritical a lot of the time. They'll complain about them and then buy them. You're right. That's absolutely real. But as someone that had, that, you know, that doesn't, it just, it feels really bad. I will also say it would feel a lot better if it didn't come out as something so last minute. They specifically held it, held it, the fact that they existed until just before release, so that way they didn't get negative press up to release dates. If they had said it would have been a thing the whole time, it would have been received differently. You know? Can acknowledge something is shitty while knowing it is profitable yeah yeah exactly miasmites interesting when'd you switch i switched to this class a little while ago i would say like an hour ago now i had just discovered it i want to try it out If I can catch them while they're low to the ground, I can really I take them out quickly. I can do no less in service to the arisen. Well said. You must end yourself with that oil post haste. Yeah, like Darth Maul, kinda. Yeah. We ought to consider this a lesson. This is what befalls one who lets down their guard. Let my magic grant you. Damn, that combo's so sick. There's a cave here. Maybe we check this out. that guy dude it's it kind of sucks fighting the archers i won't lie it kind of sucks fighting those guys we got two paths here i mislike it here peril seems to lurk around every corner caution is wise over is foolish oof Is it a game I can buy without feeling scammed? I mean, that's a matter of opinion, right? You can end up feeling scammed just because you don't like the game. That's a matter of subjectivity. That's up to you. I'm having a good time. I feel it's worth my money.
Alright, there was the other path, so I'm gonna go back in there and check it out. Someone made camp here. We are in dire need of rest. Let us make camp. Nah, we're fine, dude. We're fine. Relax. My word, this ox cart has been destroyed. Well, I mean, it's an ox cart in a cave, so I'd expect it to be destroyed to get in here to begin with. Oh, that way. That way. Stab that guy in the dick, man. That can't be good. It is a chest. I shall take a look inside. Ring of requital. Boost strength after a successful deflect. Right. Well, I don't have any deflection going on right now, so that won't work for me. I never said it's the best thing since sliced bread, and I don't feel like I'm being scammed, Galred. What do you want about? Hope you're not referring to me with that statement. I didn't say this is the best game ever. It's not even the best game from Capcom, let alone ever. It was a personal stab, yeah. Right in the dick. Where did the uh the mage go? Let my magic imbue your weapon with the fury of the elements. I am your part of the problem, definitely referring to you. You love microtransactions and you laud them, or don't you? Be honest. I have literally said dozens of times in the last few hours alone that I don't like microtransactions. Right, do we have Billy back now? Or do I have to actually enter this to get Billy back? Alright, I gotta enter it to get Billy. Where's Billy? There he is. I am ashamed to have fallen so short. I shall ponder my failings, Arisen. How long is this path? Oh, we're almost there. Oh, more gobbos. My max health is about half what it should be, so I'm uh, getting concerned now. Oof. That special attack on the Mystic Spear Hand is just incredibly powerful. Sorry. 
Billy seems squishy. You would think a fighter would be a little bit more tanky, yeah. But to be fair, when he died, it's because of the way the water works in this game. The water has that special thing going on about it. What was that? Where if you fall into it, it basically just eats you. Oh, Cyclops, there. I gotta cut this chain to get the mask off. But he's swinging around like crazy right now. There we go. Ready to drop off. Oh, I'm bouncing on his head somehow. There we go. Get out of the way! I can't believe that didn't hit me. Some heals. Thank you. Nice. Good job, Billy. I meant to grab onto his face instead I grabbed his hand. There we go. Finish him off here. Good shit, man. Let's ride it down. Hell yeah. Felt like Legolas riding the beast down to its death. Destination is a distant one. Travel by ox cart might be worth considering. One hopes these carts offer comfort commensurate to their nice. Cost. Good stuff, Blue. Yeah, asking for it. Nothing I can't have. We get a hell yeah, hell yeah, hell yeah. Oh, ho, ho. Knock the soul out of that guy. All right, now we want to go this way to get back into the town. That was a lengthy trip, but we cleared off a good portion of the map there. Dare I say it? We trounced our foe, well and true. No doubt this triumph will spur us into the next.
I was kind of hoping to find another Griffin along the way, too. I find myself reflecting on the time I fell in battle. Being separated from our master. Maybe just grab you off their back and throw you across the map. Um, I've not seen one grab off of his own back yet. No, I don't know if they're capable. Their arms are a little bit too short to reach, I think. But if you are, like, on their front, they can absolutely grab you. I've had it happen. It happened just yesterday. Mayhap this ladder is here. All right, where is this guy? All right, let's just follow this road back to the, uh... For a reason. The guy. To you, a reason. Hey, Daniel, it's going well. How are you? Other than bosses feeling very repetitive right now, not much change in the mobs. Yeah, um, at first it felt good because there was a good variety, and then you realize that so far that's, like, all there is. Even the large monsters, the only ones that I really enjoy fighting right now are the griffins, just because I've only fought them a couple times. I would like to fight more dragons too, but I'm sure that'll happen ah, towards the end of the game. Returned. How did you feel? Splendid. You've been an immense help, I must say. The cart reached its destination safe and sound, and from the tele. Ox carts seem a convenient choice for longer journeys. Just gave me miner's hosen. Well, that's a little bit better than what I have. We'll throw them on. I see no harm in making Why not? use of them as needed, Master. Okay, now we My need to make it over to me. the uh, vocation guy. I've gained five vocation levels on that trip, so we should have good access to some abilities now. That's not the guy. I overheard some of the soldiers standing guard outside the palace, discussing a curious rumor. Oh, did it pertain to the Queen Regent? Have you business with the guild, sir? I should be glad to assist you. Okay, skills. All right, so that's the same thing, but stronger. That's the same thing, but stronger as well. That summons more of them. Humble offering. Levitates nearby objects and hurls them at the closest hostile targets. Thefts Han saps the target's vitality and grants it to the user in the form of stamina. Cannot be employed against targets that lack a corporeal form. Interesting. Mirror Vesture. Erects a magical barrier around the user and any allies within range. Each barrier only lasts a very short span of time, but nullifies all manner of attacks for the duration. Holy. That seems OP. Sky Dragon's Fang Tooth. Starts swiftly into the air before plunging down at high speed. Inflicts greater harm when evading a target's attack. Interesting. An Unto Sky. Launches smaller targets great distances, forcibly removing them from battle. Oh my god. Launch targets grant no experience and drop no items. Larger targets are not launched, but struck with a solid blow. Interesting. What about core skills? Instantly approach a target that was struck by four biting bolt or scattering bolts. Interesting. Let's try it out. Marine bolt extends the effective range of the bolts. Okay. And winding cuts. Spins the duo spear forward, whirling and slashing through targets without pause. Repeatedly pressing the activation button spins the duo spear faster. All right. Yeah, that was the yeet skill. Hastens movement speed while carrying or lifting, and then opulence increases gold obtained when acquiring coin pouches. I mean, sure. Hmm. Kind of like the idea of using an, uh, like a man as a weapon after stunning him. That could be fun. Definitely want mirror vesture. That seems OP. And then Sky Dragon's Fang Tooth. It's a nice little like dodge and counter attack.
I like the idea of this, but I don't want to just like launch targets away and not get experience from them. Hey, Ghost, how you doing? Yeah, let's use Humble Offering and replace Dragon Stab. I can just use my enemy, like smaller enemies as weapons there. And the Devout Offering, an advanced form of Humble Offering that has an extended range allowing targets to be lifted from further away. Okay. Okay, man. How about you, Billy? Anything new here? Yeah, we know of that. Yeah, I don't care about that either. Okay. Always a pleasure. Good stuff. Now let's use... I know I found at least a bug. There we go. Let's go to the house and do a rest. I need to do a sleep. And then after we do a sleep, we can get back to questing. Now what's this? I had a feeling you would not be here today, yet I still set out to see you. More the fool I know. However, I do not regret my coming here. At the very least, tis an opportunity to pass on this package, to which I hope will be of some small aid to you on the road ahead. Take care, Arisen. May this letter find you in good health. Look at that. A free fairy stone. Would you look at that, dude? Here's a thought. Um, when you rest at a campfire, you get the bonus of cooking food. When you sleep at uh, your house or an inn, you do not. So I wonder if there's like, is there a buff that I don't know about when you rest at home? Like, do you get something more out of that? I should have put that on Billy, actually. There we go. No cooking in your house? <laughs> I guess not, dude. I would, I would think that resting at home would have better bonuses you than anywhere else, though, you would think. I'm doing all right, Ghost. Just playing video games. Shall we hunt a few monsters to start you get a off? sense of security? Yeah. Come. We've much to be getting on with. A new day. Water under the bridge, Calred. We're good, dude. Now, uh, I just wanted to be clear, like, when I say something, unless I otherwise say that I don't mean it, I always mean it. This is something that I was taught by my mom at a young age due to the circumstances that I was in with my father being a piece of shit to always just kind of be upfront and blunt about things. Don't mince words, say what you mean. And so with that comes the idea where there's nuance in things. It doesn't always have to be one side of the bridge or the other, you know? There's nuance. There's more to it than just picking a side. Okay, quest time. <laughs> he wants me to return to Mel from time to time, so I guess I'll have to do that. Right, that's where we have to speak formally. I still haven't found where I'm supposed to take this guy. Find a place with plenty of tomes. I just don't know where that would be. All right, let's do this. It has been a few days time, so let's set this priority and go see Selena.
wherever she may be. Uh, this is the house, right? Hey, pardon, sir, but have you any information about what happened here? A couple were found dead, you see. Oh. Poor Albert was stabbed from behind, and Selena, by all appearances, ended her own life after killing him. Oh. I can't fathom it. I knew the both of them, and I cannot imagine Selena doing such a thing, let alone to her dear husband. One witness claims Selena was turned away from a noble's estate shortly before the incident. But how could that possibly have led to all so gruesome as this? Right. What a miserable fight. We ought not to have well. involved ourselves in this affair, methinks. <laughs> well, um, hmm. Well, I think uh, the evidence was a little bit too much for Selena, and she just kind of lost herself. Yikers! Might... Be worth. Yeah, thanks, Billy. Yeah. <laughs> all right, I guess I'll go get my formal attire again. I didn't sell the formal attire, right? Might reveal aught of interest. I should see if I can buy a better weapon. I'll go see if I can buy a better weapon, go back to the house, hit the storage, get out the formal attire, and then do that quest. Don't forget you have to look from this side. Come take a look. Yeah, it's a good bit better. For 9,900, I think we'll buy it. Very heavy make. The more experienced its wielder, the sharper the blades seem to become. There's also Initiate's Blade. That's what I have on right now. Yeah, let's take this. Let's do it. Equip it, and then enhance. Enhance. Well, we've killed some choppers. Monstrous Fang and Silver Ore. All right, we're maxing this bad boy out. All right, Strength is 408, Magic 379. Pretty good. Okay, some basic upgrades are capable here. Yeah, we've got enough for all of this. Good. Very nice. Do come again. Our coin reserves are much depleted after that indulgence. Yeah, I spent a good penny there. It's fine. <laughs> it's fine, man. If the money's not doing anything else, we may as well use it. I was just, I was a little bit um, concerned about like spending that much money at first, as well as I was concerned about like getting the upgrades too early. But we're not finding nearly as much gear as I thought we would, to be honest. Courtly tunic, courtly breeches. Spend more on weapons than a house, I know, right? You procured suitable raiment. I'm glad it notifies you. I can't take it anymore. That's good news. Shall we report this development to Captain Brandt? That's medieval for you? Yeah, I guess so. I thought there would be a doorway. I mean, I guess there kind of is. Oh, this is how you get to this chest. Aha. The person we're here to meet is nowhere to be seen. Shall we come back later? 
Waiting around doesn't seem like to do as much good. What could we be missing here? Nothing, man. Just a pop a squat. I'm gonna get you a house so I have somebody to play 40k against. Can I be your neighbor, Screamer? There is much we ought to tend to. If we are to strengthen, all shall change once we have attended the coronation. If your majesty has any unfinished business to attend to, it is best you do so before we depart. Um, yeah, let's Very go. Well. That's fine. The coronation is to take place on the morrow. We shall depart early in the morn, so your majesty will do well to get a good night's rest. Okay, the following morning, Vernworth Castle. within my mind it commands me sways my very will sways your will could it be that for god's sway we must quit this place your majesty i fear our plans may fall to naught. let us return to the tavern well False sovereign commanded the pawns at the coronation, proving his own powers arisen. According to Regent King Sven, the pretender was wearing some sort of lavish necklace at the time. I imagine this artifact is the god's way mentioned in that letter. Perchance it is a tool that grants power akin to that of the true arisen. Alas, unless we find some way to unmake this god's way's power, proving your majesty's legitimacy shall be difficult indeed. Allow me to speak to the agent we captured some days past. Perchance he knows aught of use. Never could I have imagined. Pray perchance, aught perchance. I suppose it's pointless to. Await point Captain Brand's plan of action. Okay, we will await that. In the meantime, let's go do other things. Red event of the calamity. Maybe we go make our way back to Melv again. <laughs> Surely a dragon will land there again for us to fight. But then I'll just run away. Should we make our way to Fulvio in Batal? It is uh, quite a ways away. Like, quite a ways away. Way down there. But, we just kind of path way westward use some camps along the way follow these paths you guys want to go on a grand adventure for a while let's do it the results of captain broad's investigation it'll pass the time dude it is no great shock to me Mystic and the Mystic Spear Hand now. I'm going to keep leveling it up and see where it goes, yeah. Put those away. Let's sleep until daytime. Getting and then we rest leave. Is an important duty in its own right. Our adventure continues. Screamer, thank you for the $2 super chat. Now nah, just buy a fast travel. Here you go. <laughs> just yonder. Wait, it says I can consult with him already. Screamer, thank you for the two, dude. I appreciate it. Thanks a lot. Thanks a lot. 
All right, well, I guess we can just do this since he's ready to go already. I was thinking it would take some time, but I guess not. No adventure. Without power for an hour, the com power company said their ETA is another four and a half hours. Guess no gaming tonight. That blows. I'm sorry, dude. It sucks when that happens. You know, luckily that's not happened where I live in a while, but... It is uh, getting on into the spring months, which mean here come the storms, which mean power outages. So I'm sure it'll happen before too long. There is much we ought to tend to if we are to strengthen your majesty's claim as a true arisen. If the information we pry from the agent is to be believed, there is a place in Batal devoted to the study of arts most queer. I believe it is worthy of investigation. Should fortune smile upon us, your Majesty may even discover some method of undoing the Godsway's hold over the pawns. Yet official dealings to experiment and Batal are suspended, and tis no simple matter to gain passage through the latter's fortress. Fortunately for us, however, the agent was hiding this on his person. I bid you take it. Tis an entry permit, allowing passage through Batal's fortress. It even bears the crest of the Batali Palace. It must have been commissioned by someone with great influence. I doubt any would dare impede your passage with such an item in your possession. There is one other thing, Your Majesty. An oracle who once served in the Vermondian court now resides in Batal. This oracle foretold the coming of the Arisen and was banished from the kingdom when her prophecy displeased the Queen Regent. Indeed, twas by this same oracle's power that the agent in question came to know of your majesty's whereabouts. The oracle knows much of the Arisen. Should you make her acquaintance, she may be able to offer you aid during your infiltration. Okay. Port crystal. I guess we'll keep that on us and maybe use that when we get down to Batal. Um, yeah, I just kicked off some of these quests that I no longer have access to. I have to go down to Batal anyway, but I'm glad that we did this before going to Batal because I wouldn't have been able to make it down there anyhow. However, these two quests are pretty close to one another, so let's just get this set as priority and we'll be on our way. If we seek further knowledge of the Godsway, we ought to make for Batal. All right, yeah. So let me just see what I want to do here. All right. We're just going to head straight west, clear out this little bit of path this way, and keep going west from there. And then when we can find a way to go south, we will. Me, master. I shall guide you to the location. Before we go, though, we need to make sure that our pawns are up to date. Yes. I'm only glad I don't have to lead the way for a change. Very good. Yo, Undecay Noctis, thank you for five big gifted members to the chat, dude. Thank you so much. Very kind of you, dude. Thank you for doing that. Sirosh. Um, so what do we need? Uh, we need a higher level archer and a mage. Let's go I with Kate. For spotting materials that can be used to have a rotten sore <laughs> shore fish, dude. At have a heart go, too. Knowing I fought to the Are you fit to travel? Then let's not let's not dawdle. Now I need an archer. Any archers in the vicinity? You're a thief, fighter, warrior, lots of warriors going on. All right, let me specify this. I need an archer. I love the search engine in the game. 
Undecay, thank you so much, man. I really appreciate it, dude. All right, Danella, you're the first one to come up. You come with me. You can count on me to fly to your aid in your hour of need, Master. Sounds great. Knowing when... It was a fine journey we shared. Wherever you're It will be an to. honor to serve by your side. Okay. And now we're good. Let's go. You deserve it. Thanks so much, dude. This rumor has been troubling me. Ever since Man's out here gifting it. members to I'll other people. Sven when he's not even a member himself. <laughs> and then he goes, wait, why I'm not a member? Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> Undecay, I appreciate it, dude. <laughs> this ladder looks sturdy enough to climb. Perhaps new discoveries await us above. Above. Let's go on a grand adventure. Fixing now? Dude, you don't even have to. You just gifted five members. It's not mandatory to be a part of what I do here anyway. I'm just glad to have you here. Remember when Mel gifted Mel a membership? <laughs> yeah. It's kind of... Kind of janky sometimes how it works. I gotta remember to use that when I'm trying to dodge an enemy's attack too. Freshly rested as we are, this battle ought to be a thing. Try not to get hit. Let's do that big first place. I grant you boring flame. Oh yeah? Oh, that's just a, a pawn. Okay, I got you. I was confused. Let's head westward. Is that the main path I want to go on? Well, yeah, I guess it is. Yo, Undecay Noctis becoming a tier 2 member. Big. Thank you, man. I really appreciate it, dude. Thank you so much. Gifting some members and becoming a member once again. I appreciate it. I'm glad to have you here for it, Coco. You know, I did sleep until morning. It's already nighttime. Swinging at. Strike fast and true, and our quarry shall fall. Whoa, that got a little weird. I gotta try to throw someone. Hold on. Let my magic imbue your weapon with the fury of the <laughs> Yes. <laughs> There's more around. Okay. You truly are formidable, Arisen. 
We keep going west. Might do to equip that skill. It's kind of fun. As far as damaging, I mean, it's not hugely damaging. You have my protection. Nope, that is a boar, not a wolf. I guess we're good. Yeah, the bubble shield seems like it's going to be OP. I just haven't found a really much use in using it yet. How long does it last? this way, as I recall, from my last sojourn beyond the rift. Not bad, not bad. <laughs> I can't throw a ghost. Good job. Good job. Yo, Lucid, thank you for the Twitch Prime. Thank you, man. I appreciate it loads. Thank you a ton. Yeah, that's what it's all about, Coco. I'm glad I can help, dude. Let's go on the northern split here. Relax. Relax. on him? That's sick. No mercy. Are you Everything's fine. Oh God. I'm doing so much damage while up here. <laughs> there it is. I ran out of stamina. Who the hell are you? Gallantry from that guy. What does that do? 
Where it takes more damage from range attacks from behind, but less if hit from the front. Interesting. You trying to piss me off? Yeah, dude. That's what I do. Hey, thanks, Ghost. I appreciate you hanging out, man. Take it easy. What people watch on Twitch when it's 1440p over here? People have different platform preferences. Not to mention, uh, it just kind of helps me out more. Being on both sides, if possible, is cool. But also, some people don't really know streaming on YouTube exists, and there's other people on YouTube that, that don't know Twitch even exists. So it's just a matter of trying to get crossover. Ouch. Thank you kindly. Oh, he's sounding the alarm. There was a lot of goblins that got taken out extremely quickly. This is the beauty of going on new paths I haven't been on yet. Finding these golden trove beetles. So nice. Yeah, I keep forgetting that's a thing, Max. I just tried to do it and it just kind of like failed on me. It was a glorious success. Would that we might always be so in step, eh? Are there any other are there any big dungeons in this game or is it mostly just open world fights? Uh there's some caves and stuff. I haven't found anything like massive, but there are there have been some decent sized caves so far. There it is. One cannot be too careful. I grant you roaring flame. Oh, she's got a mall. I think this is the first time I've actually seen a mall. That's sick. I should just go the other way. Uh. 
Now then, which way? We decide based I shan't let them fall. Damn it, I wanted to hit the guy up here. Uh oh. Um. There's a dragon here. Everyone get ready for a big fight. Now time for high fives. It's dragon time. the way the fire gamers Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh boy. Riskiest revives of my What the hell there's goblins here? Bless. Get me the hell out of the way. Billy, why are you dying? You're the tank. Get out of the way. Get out of the way. Ah, lovely. The pawns are not smart. Got the commands, so we're just gonna do that. All right, it's this. Oh, that's fire! Dude, everyone's dying a miserable death. Uh, where is the, do I not have the water stuff on me? Quenching syrup. I can't use it, even though I'm on fire, apparently. Oh, it's because it just ended. That's lightning. Hi, uh, yeah. Oh, dude. Put him down right here, quickly. Stabbing its heart for a whole lot of damage. Okay, that's good. Billy, will you stay alive for more than two seconds?
Incoming lightning. Okay, dude. Wow, Billy, you actually got out of the way that time. I'm going to fall off. and I'm going to take a lot of damage here. Oh, I just died. Unless I can do this. Oh, that didn't heal me. Son of a bitch, I died. God damn it, man. I spent way too much time reviving the pawns in that fight, which was rather annoying. Unfortunate, dude. If we seek further knowledge of the God's way, we ought to make for the Tal. Pray, allow me to show you the... All right, I guess we should take a nap. Well... You insist? God damn I'm it, man. I'm glad I don't have to lead the way for a change. Kind of HP that dude has? Yeah. I have no food on me. Rest till morning. I've not taken out any dragons so far, Psyduck. I have fought several of them, but they all, like, fly away or I die like I just did. Feeling... Rested, I trust. I'm playing on PC, Orlando. As far as FPS goes, you can see it on screen top right. Must we run everywhere? You are an impatient one, Arisen. Let us endeavor to keep up, though we are less fleet of foot. Misty marshes. Another statue. Mayhap will yield us sort of use. Why don't we go take a look? Twenty three oh nine. Not bad. There was an ogre up here we can kill. <laughs> I'm a knack for gathering items and am ever on the hunt for new finds. That's great, dude. You keep doing you. I've just had a thought. Curious thing. One of my former masters chased the higher only women. I want a while. Oh! Strike fast and true. And I held on tight. We're fine. Damn it. Oh, I just got punched.
I just poked its eye out. Yo, he just caught me. <laughs> Thanks, Billy. You must steer clear of fire. I grant you fire's blaze. Use it well. Not what I wanted. Still not what I wanted. But it's fine. Alright, you guys will be able to handle that last one, right? I'm kind of upset about how that dragon fight went, if I'm being honest. I really feel like I uh, spent more time trying to revive my teammates than I did doing damage, which is frustrating. What's my graphics card? 4080. You can check out my specs by typing exclamation mark specs. Notice your stamina was affected when you're heavy. Does that include Billy? I think so. Perhaps we might take a moment to savor the scene. Right you are. Ah, now here's a surprise. At least all our efforts That's were some nice scenery. Interesting. I now what? Who do you think you are, man? Thumbs up. Honk, honk. To answer your question, Orlando, about like frame drops, it only seems to happen when I'm in the city. Outside of that, the game runs well for me. Am I the first to notice we've all got different vocations? Our respective abilities are unique as well. We must each of us hone our skills. A jack of all trades is a master of none. There, master. Oh, I, I, I said it earlier, and I said it a few times yesterday. I'm going to say it again. This game really makes me want to play Monster Hunter. That was well thought. There's no one standing who might say that. Most of the enemy gained the upper hand. The early Griffin gets the worm, as they say. A lot, lot of hobgoblins out this way. Oh, I missed. If we mastered that attack, we would be invincible see a bug up there. Can't get to it from this side. There's a small path down this way, though. Because your weapon's like the insect glaive? I said that when I was playing the, uh... 
the thief as well, though. Like I said, I said it yesterday, too. And I'm not the type of guy to use the knives in Monster Hunter, but it still made me want to play Monster Hunter regardless. That's a way down as well. Looks like in order to get up there, I'm going to have to go all the way... Yeah, screw that. I don't know if Roar and Let's Resolve and Braggart's Roar stack. As long as you use Braggart's Roar on a different weapon, since it is an Ash of War, and then Royal Knight's Resolve just before you hit something, yes. Braggart's Roar is a longer buff. It's like 45 seconds, whereas Royal Knight's Resolve is much lower timer. But they are unique buffs of one another. Royal Knight's Resolve really is just like a huge weapon damage buff temporarily, right? I think it's just one hit. Whereas Braggart's Roar lasts for that whole 45 seconds. We got an ogre. that that missed. In the face. Oh. Man's going crazy here. map here. Wait, why are all these materials showing up? What happened? What happened for those to show up? I'm confused. Oh well, let's keep going west. Actually. Forager. I don't recall getting the forager skill, but apparently it's active, and I don't know why. Oh, I just almost sent it off. I didn't mean to. Map's huge. It is pretty big, yeah. Let's have a lot going on.
Oh, wee, that's a lot of wolves. Got a little weird there for a minute. Could be on a pawn I hired. Yeah, it's just weird that it activated now instead of earlier when I hired it, you know? Come to think of it, the pain I experienced at the coronation was beyond imagining. What baleful art could grant one other than... There are no mounts in the game now. Roll over pawns. Harpies. Yeah, that wolf was indeed twerking. Oh my god. Urge. a stronger one than the earlier I think unless I'm misremembering I thought the one earlier had uh, four total health bars this one has five Oh my god, you guys see that? It's just like half its health bar. Insane damage. Holy shit. Oh, it's mad. I should jump off. Regain stamina. Hey Jack, hope all is well with you too, dude. Nice, Andrew. That's sick, man. Let go, let go, let go. Oh God. I'm very dead. I'm so dead. Oh dude, it just delivered me to the ground. That's such good news. Oh, I got so lucky. Oh, that's not so lucky. Where am I? Come on, it's back.
You shall not leave. Not this time. All right, time to finish the job, gamers. Damn, that was so sick. The fighting the Griffins is the best part of the game so far. <laughs> that was so good. The fact that it tried flying away, but it was already on it, and I got to knock it out of the sky. So cool, man. So cool. Well, little graveyard here. That was seriously cool. Yeah, fighting the monsters in this game is a good time. PC specs, exclamation mark specs. We'll uh, bring up a link for you. Nice shots. Griffin looks sick too. Yeah. The Griffin fights are definitely the highlight for me in this game so far. Fighting the dragons is cool too, but the, it's just... Oh, I'll take that. The uh, fire just really hurts the pawns a lot. They just don't get out of the way of it. Yeah, we'll keep the Expeditioner's Cloak on. I need to reduce my weights. That'll help. Very good. Can you go solo? You can, but it's very inadvisable because you'll be at a major disadvantage doing so. You need different spreads of damage because different things have different strengths and weaknesses. Going solo just makes it way more difficult. I was stolen from you, my lantern. Who took my lantern? I got my lantern back, apparently. More Final Fantasy 15 as opposed to Elden Ring? No, it, it it's hard to explain. It's just that, like, things that have resistances in this game, have if it's resistant to something, it is risen? seriously resistant to something. And so you need to have, like, a good spread amongst your team of different types of damage. You know, things like pierce and slash matter, things like different magical elements like fire, electricity, and cold, they matter. Uh, it just, it's very different and hard to explain outside of that. But also, because of the weight factor in this game, it's useful to have extra people in your team for the idea of spreading out loot so that way you can carry more. We 
But yeah, you'll notice when you play the game, like if you play the game, that when something is resistant to something, it is heavily resistant. It's not like a slight resistance. <laughs> it's like if you're not hitting something in the right spot, you're going to do no damage. If you don't have the right type of elements going on, you're not going to do much damage at all. And we found a bit of a town here. That's good, because I can sleep here. Say, so, you wouldn't happen to have seen a pretty stone lying about, would you? One befitting the name the Jadeite Orb. Um, no. It was stolen from me while I was delivering it. And if Master Everard should find out, he'd wring my neck. There's no exaggeration. He said people killed a four. More than a few at that. Oh. To be quite truthful. I'd intended to sell off the Jadeite Orb and quit this place for good. Working under a man such as him, I'd only get chewed up till he decided to spit me out. Unless... Unless you were to find it for me. Would you, sir? I'll pray do a poor man a kindness. No, trove beetles are permanent, Monarch. When they increase your weight, it is a permanent effect. It's really nice. Checkpoint Rest Town, settlement of the Vermund Batal border. Nice. This means new items, new quests. Hell yeah. Let's see if this guy has any better armaments. Hello there. Welcome, sir. After all. It is folly to linger on a single vocation when there are oh, this so is an always inn. a pleasure. I thought this was a, a blacksmith. Well met, sir. How might I be of service? Welcome, sir. After all, it is folly to linger on a single vocation when there are so many. There goes the collection. I've only turned in two. <laughs> Made any progress? I'm barely using this setching blade. I don't really I really don't like that skill much to be honest. I don't care for that. Let's just get this. And then throw that on there. Always a pleasure. I assume by that symbol that it was... Oh, maybe it's underneath. No? Food. The sword and staff. Probably the inn. Nope, it's just a bar. Oh, I see it on the map right over here. This is the symbol for blacksmith, I think. Blacksmith and armorer. Well, oh, there's always demand for weapons. Yes, very good. Do you have anything befitting a mystic sword hand? Spear hand, rather. Ooh, the flambirds right there. Look at that. You don't have any twin spears, do you? Eye crusher? Dude, nice. Life taker, eye crusher. Flamberge. Almace, that's the um, sword I saw earlier in the game on the other pawn. Those ice damage. Kind of unfortunate that there's no uh, twin spears here. Big sad. How about Billy? 
I don't need enough. I don't have enough money to buy that anyway. Order Shit. Where quarrels occur every Couldn't do that if I wanted to. Do come again? Still haven't seen any Not knackers fine. to get knacker horns That's either. Just as well. Oddly enough. Better to be selective than wasteful. Browser greetings. Hey. You are the arisen, are you not? Maybe. Tell is you travel quite a bit. Take it easy, Coco. Tell me, in your comings and goings, did you happen to encounter a man by the name of Offold? He seems to have vanished while in possession of a treasure known as the Jadeite Orb. My fellow merchants are scouring the city for him as we speak, but have had no luck as yet. This again. And if I may be candid, our primary concern is not the merchant, but rather the orb. Tis an item of precious importance to myself and my partners, you see. I must see it reclaimed, post haste. And in my hour of need, who should wander by but the good arisen? What say you, sir? Would you be so kind as to seek out the Jadeite Orb on my behalf? You will be rewarded handsomely for your service. Of that, I can assure you. Maybe. Sirs Offulv and Everard each seek the Jadeite Orb. To whom ought we to grant it? Assuming we find the thing at all. Yeah, that's a great Whatever question. Choice you make arisen, I'm sure it will be the right one. Who do we trust here? Hello, sir. The sovereign's retinue makes to fell the dragon. At we must rest, though the sun is still up. We take a sleep. We take a nap. I feel refreshed and ready for a new day. Come, we've much to be getting on with. I hope you slept well. Excuse me. Okay. Here's the deal, guys. I'm going to call it a night here. This is a great spot to leave off. When I come back tomorrow, we'll Have pick up... Uh... Oh, my God. The ancient battleground to the north is overrun with hordes of fell beasts. Okay. And in times past, t'was safe since a few days past... Skeletons and phantoms have made this their nightly battleground. It could be that aught's befallen the cenotaph. Say, if I cannot... Okay, that's another thing to do. But yeah, I'm going to call it a night here. I'll be back tomorrow to pick up where we left off right here. We got a few quests in this area already, some new things to explore. And also, I'm noticing a marked increase in strength in the monsters out this way, which is really exciting. It's getting a little more difficult out here, which is nice. Which is very nice. A lot of things to uh, explore to the north. And of course we do have the main quest of making our way even further south too. Lots of things to do tomorrow. I'm looking forward to it. Thank you all for tuning in. Hope you enjoyed your stay. Thank you for leaving a like on the video. Very close to 300. You know for a new game on my channel that's not bad. Thank you guys for being here. I appreciate all of your love and support. And I will see you tomorrow. Until then be excellent to each other. Good night everyone.